Okay. Should be good. Should be good. <clears throat> Make our new hunter. You know what our hunter's name is gonna be? It's gonna be Winner because that's 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 what the hunter will be. Big ol' Winner. Uh, I believe it's three movement, one in HP, everything else in attack is what I want. But I feel pretty good about that. I feel pretty good about that. I keep forgetting which one I was. Hey, yes, this one. Might have been. Might have been this one. I think it was this one. Okay. Oof. Three, two, one, go! Nope. Nope. Three, two, one, go. There we go. Uh, yes, that's correct. What did I do wrong on A? I did something wrong. It doesn't matter. Whatever, dude. It can be named AC. Okay, cool. Going for a book. We're going for the, the beige book. Like, uh, looks like winners ending up next to a few items. Might be an okay start. is your best bet. Really? You're getting so many books. And you got a data disk, that's not worth very much. Huh. There's the item, okay. Why are there three <laughs> gray books in this room? Um, okay. Okay, it doesn't matter. Winner, I want to start going over to player B to take the target item. Uh, you can go pretty much anywhere. You should probably go to the exit, actually, just to warp somewhere more useful. And B, you should go get this flag and the other item, just for the sake of getting more points and leveling up. Very nice. That'll help you out a little bit. Uh, actually, I suppose... 
Player B should not take the item. I should let player A take it. Or not player A, I should let winner take it. Um, oh, there is another item out there. I didn't even notice. Well, now I know. Um, I want player A to take this item. And then I want player A to go beat up. I gotta stop calling him player A. Winner. I want winner to take the item. And then I want winner to go beat up player B. However, I also... How far out is this other item I saw? Am I crazy? Is there not anything out there? Maybe there's not. I don't know. Yo, Mole. Thank you for the GL. This should be a very silly speed run. Am I wrong? No, there's totally something out there. There's multiple items out there. Goodness. It's fine. They will take a little bit to get to. They can be for... Oh, there we go. Perfect. Player B can get those. Possibly with the help of A and AC. What is this item pool right now? <laughs> Just like, to clarify, there are a hundred different items in this game, and look at the, the pool of items that we've picked up. I, I don't think I've ever seen duplicates on a single floor, and right now we're sitting on five. yellow flag, actually. Much rather have that. Another gray book! What happened? How? That's so strange. It's pretty simple. Every level, it looks like this, there's four players, you're on a randomly generated map collecting items. Uh, there's one target item that you're trying to get, and once you get the target item, you go to the exit. That's the entire gameplay loop. And then it's just a question of, like, you know, actually following what the items are and where you should go. Only three damage, really? That was a bad roll. And then sometimes monsters show up. Literally N++. It is the same game. That's why I got into this, clearly. Uh, yeah. Fight back and try not to die. I said try not to die. Come on, player A. Oh, ridiculous. Mole, the thing I love about this game, though, is there is no balancing of the randomness. It's horrible. It's so bad in that regard. Okay, how much money do we each have? Uh, not enough, but some of us can sell some things. No, I don't want to do another mission yet. Ooh, that book is 200? Yes, please. Uh, there is a story in this game. The mode I'm playing at the moment is just multiplayer to help me grind levels. Uh, but there is a story that I will eventually be doing, and 
uh, some of the story missions, instead of finding an item in the dungeon, uh, one of the enemies already has the item, and you need to go track them down and kill them before they can get to the exit. And it is entirely possible for the enemy to just spawn next to the exit and you have no chance. They... it really seems like they just didn't try at all. It's so funny, I love it. Uh, I want you to get that item, and then after that, go for the green flag, and you can go for that yellow flag. The flags give you points, uh, the points you get are also a means of leveling up, but they are less effective than, uh, than selling the items you pick up. That's where the exit is, okay. Good roll, very good. No? Oh, come on. Nah. You... can you make it up here? No, you should be going the other way. And then you... there is an item over here you should get. More or less, Winner is the character that I'm actually caring about. The one that I actually want to get leveled up. So all of the good items I'm just going to pass off to him, like that emerald I just picked up. Oh my goodness. But the quality of the items you pick up does depend on the average level of the characters target item. So, I do want to level up the other characters eventually. I, I'm not gonna leave them forever. Uh, sure, fight back. Yo, Lucas, thank you, thank you. How did last night go? I didn't finish the game, but, uh... But it was going well. But I got pretty far. <clears throat> okay, what do you each have? Your item is garbage, so I think you should actually just go fight this monster. You're not gonna be able to kill it, or even do much damage to it. But you get points for hurting things, so attack it. Yes, you gotta hurt them though. Oh my god. I hate these robots. This is a fresh run. I started over. Started a new one. Actually gonna try to finish it. All in one sitting. Red disc, okay. And the other enemy, interesting. Player A, you have... A and B have some good things. So I'd actually really like to get them over there. Uh, which... Is gonna be this way? Yo, Gene! You had this game? You're kidding! I... I haven't found anybody else who had heard of this. <laughs> it seems very silly. I've been enjoying... I've been enjoying trying this. Yeah, The Hunter on PAL. I was doing some research about it. I saw it had that name. 
Uh, I got it because it's made by one of my favorite uh, publishers in the US, A1 Games. The budget games division of Age Tech. Um, you may know A1 Games from their racing game titled Racing, or their tennis game titled Tennis. It's great. I love I love A1 Games. I don't want to fight this thing. That's a waste of time. I just want to get over to the other guys so I can take their items. Uh, this is by far the most complex game I have seen from them. <laughs> and I've enjoyed it. It's very silly. It's very silly. I like it. Uh, you should run away too. Is there a flag remotely nearby, maybe? Maybe not. Yeah, I've heard that title too. PS feed and scrolling through the store news in there. Neat. I think I left a trap here, so I'm hoping... I'm just gonna run down this way, so I won't hit it. There's another item. I forgot about that. <laughs> Oops. It's a good thing I have AC running off this way. If you're wondering why the player names are A, B, and AC, it's because I typoed. I, I wanted it to just be A, B, and C, and I messed up, and this is what we have now. Yeah, I'm curious about the trap dodging. I also read the button you can hit to potentially dodge traps. You can also hit it to potentially avoid enemies critting against you. You know how if they roll doubles, they can, like, panic you or whatever the game calls it? Apparently, you can avoid that as well. Okay, you surrender, give me... Oh, I want both of these, but give me the target item. That garnet's really good, too. I might be able to get back, get back to winner real quick, though. Uh, you pick up this flag, actually, and then Winner can take your item from you. Game Boy! Very nice. Okay, just set that trap down, that's fine. You have a silver thing on you, I think? Oh, you have both of these. That's worth more. I'm pretty sure that's worth more. What is Winner's inventory looking like? Winner still has room in the inventory, so I will give over this garnet as well. Uh, and you can... I forgot I set that there. <laughs> uh, you can go this way, I guess? Go run into the exit, see if you show up somewhere useful. I was hoping player B could get in the way, um, yeah, just fight back. And stop this enemy from attacking Winner, but it doesn't matter. Not dead yet, really. Okay, yeah, oh, I should have moved first. I should have moved to get closer to A. Oh well. Dead. Good. Good, good, good. Big six. Okay, you can go try to block this enemy up here? I forgot again that there was that there. Leveling up in chunks? No. <laughs> Great exit. Um, the... Uh, wait, what do you mean by that exactly? If you're suggesting do these missions a bunch of times and then level up a bunch of times in a row, no, I'm not doing that. That's I don't think that's efficient. Um, I... The quality of items you get <laughs> depends on, um... Yeah, fight back, sure. 
depends on the average level of the party. So you do want to um, to be leveling up the party pretty consistently. <sighs> Did AC have something I wanted to hand over? Yes, I want to give... I don't know, actually. No, I'm just gonna sell that Game Boy. The Game Boy can boost your trap evasion, but it's by such a small amount, I don't think it's worth the inventory slot. hoping I could attack it. Um, there's not really anywhere for you to go. Cool. I get to go through the exit again! Let's go! <laughs> Beautiful. Okay. I see. If that's what you're asking, no, I'm not doing that. I am gonna do a few levels, a few story missions, a few levels, a few story missions. Um, I think that would increase my odds. There we go. Of um, of being able to beat missions three and six, which are the dangerous ones. Twelve thousand points. That's better. Okay, we have a lot of stuff to sell. I don't know that for sure, though. Uh, maybe I would have been better off going all through the game and then, uh, and then trying. I don't know. Level up again. Level you up. Um, health. Just level up health. Uh, yep. Okay. Now save these characters. Do some story missions. Oh, that was grind to level three, by the way. We did it. Uh, save over fights. Still need to be in here. Put these characters all away. Now do the story missions. Okay. Okay, I'm right there. The guy's up there. Looks like I, I think I'll have a pretty straight path over to him. Uh, that said, I'm gonna take this item that's right next to me, because money is money. I wonder if I could calculate, like, the ideal money per turn. To, like, figure out if it's worth spending time going out of your way to get a flag or an item or whatever. So I don't think it's... I doubt it's worth me going way out of my way, like, three or four turns to get an extra item. Excuse me? You can lose this mission? What? Wait. <laughs> They've never got after that guy before. This is the first time I'm seeing this. That's, that's news to me. Okay. Good to know. <laughs> I 
I just... I mean, I've seen bad spawns. I just... In this mission specifically, I didn't know they could go after that guy. I've only seen the AI just running around in this level. According to an AI guide I read, uh, the... the beefs agents, um, basically have random AI. Uh, that is not where I meant to move to. Um, sometimes they will be, like, you know, really aggressive and smart about trying to win. A lot of the time they will just wander around. And I don't know, I guess I assumed because that guy isn't an item that had broken the AI somehow. Every time I've done this mission before, they haven't gone after him. But no, that must have just been coincidence. See, like, right now, none of them are going after the guy. <laughs> I mean, maybe the yellow one is, but... No evidence of that. Did another enemy just spawn in front of me? I think so. Unfortunate. It was a pretty minor time loss. At least that only lasted a couple of rounds. <sighs> I would love a gun right now. you when I'm American. <laughs> Ooh! Big attack. Not enough to kill it. That's fine. Uh, let's just get the guy and leave. save again. This is why we save. And yeah, I would love to try to understand the AI more. I read through all of the game facts guides that people have written about this game. Um, and all of them had something, like each one of the guides had something in them that was wrong. So I don't fully trust any of them. But the AI guide I read matched up the most closely with my experiences with the game, so maybe there was truth to it? I don't know. Okay, this is the first hard mission. This is the mission where I actually have to fight somebody. It should be doable. He only has 15 health. That two defense isn't great, but he only has 15 health. He's pretty far away, so I should be able to cut him off pretty easy, I hope. Uh, the only thing I worry about is if he's going to, uh, you know, teleport away. <clears throat> he's gonna try to run from me, but I do have high speed as well. So I have a good shot at keeping up with him. Another valuable thing. Why are you fighting? Random AI, that's why. <laughs> that's right. Okay, so I think he's gonna heal next turn. Unless he got stupid AI, he's gonna try to heal. Except to kill him is gonna fight him. So he's gonna surrender? He's still gonna try to run. Okay. Okay. Okay, now I think he's gonna heal next turn. If my understanding of the AI is correct, he's gonna try to heal. Also, what was my, my best pace up to this point? There we go. <clears throat> that was the, the start of a run I did the other day.
And he healed. Yeah. You're probably about to die? Almost. Wouldn't have taken much more. You rolled a really good defense there. Yo, Gull. Howdy, howdy. How are you doing? How's your Friday, Ben? How's your car doing? Waiting for your pizza at the shop, I see. Okay, the agent is pretty locked in there. So I, I think I've got a good shot of running up and getting into a fight. I haven't drawn any attack cards yet, though. Which is gonna make it a little harder. <laughs> now you're running. Ooh, you gonna go for the other item? No. Killiam's got some good attack cards right now, so as long as... Okay, probably gonna do some damage? No, you chose to defend. Right. These dumb computers. <laughs> they would rather be in a stalemate forever than one of them ever win. <laughs> Evasion card. You're running now. Okay. Okay, I can hit you there. That works for me. And hopefully, Achillium will hit you there too. Please? Defending. Okay. That's a good amount. I can I can work with that. Can I get an attack card so that I can actually work with that? What is that sound happening outside of my apartment? You're fighting me back, I can probably take a hit. Some damage. Yeah, I'm fine. <clears throat> Thank you, Achillium. Yes, do attack him. And you surrendered, finally! Okay, where is it teleporting you? <laughs> right there. Okay. Okay. Why can I not draw any attack cards right now? <laughs> I placed a trap there, didn't I? Okay. Achillium, roll really well and go hit him. That's not really well! No! Oh. Oh, well. <clears throat> 
zero attack cards this whole round. I guess I'll go try to hit him and hope. I, I just need to hope. I could theoretically one-shot him. That's a lot of damage, but it's not a one-shot. Hit my trap! Oh, are you gonna hit my trap? Yes. And then Achillium's gonna go stand in the way. Low roll, low roll. Damn it. <laughs> okay, I... I can go try to hit him again. Still no attack cards. Very silly. Oh, not much damage. Honestly, should I just reset this? I... I'm so far from being able to do anything right now. CC has even higher defense. I'm nearly dead. No. I'm gonna try again. I'm gonna roll a different mission. Winding up across the map from uh, from the target definitely didn't help. We're gonna lose some time on the split, but that's okay. That's a first run. We're gonna lose some time to the non-existent run that I didn't finish. started next to the bad guy. Does he have bad stats? Please? Uh, I might be able to do something with this. I hate this game. Why? Why did that happen? That's right, Philip. You're right. You're right. And of course, the uh, the thief has both of the really strong attack cards on top of this. <sighs> cool. Here's the thing, even if I just get demolished here, if I can do a decent amount of damage and respawn somewhere and attack him again, we can be okay. It's 
just roll the dice, see if it goes well. No, it does not go well. Okay. Where do I go? Perfect. Oh my god. I mean, okay, not perfect, because he's going to get a little bit ahead of me, but he has zero speed, so I'll be able to catch up to him. He drew another plus nine attack, though? Seriously? Why? Okay, I got a plus three. I can work with that. I can work with that. Yeah, you're gonna do the big attack, so am I, though. Eight more damage. We're doing- we're doing more. He's wasting his plus nine, though, right now. See, like, it's gone. He's never gonna get that back. This is a good thing. This is actually good news. His three defense is not helping me. Okay, let's just do 21 damage right now. <laughs> it's almost 21. I'm doing nothing to him. I do need to be a little bit luckier than that. They did not cut this pizza very well. That's a shame. Is it just like... Like they indented the top of it, but uh... But didn't actually cut through the bottom? What kind of pizza is it, Golf? I don't think you said. Uh, yeah, it's, my flight is on Wednesday. I'm gonna be getting there late Wednesday night. Mm, he's pretty far away again. Uh, I think these are enemy stats I can deal with, though. High attack is actually a good thing for me, because it means his health and defense are lower. Yeah, we're not gonna be going to the going to GDQ the whole time. Just Thursday through Sunday. Yes, use your big attack cards. for the sheeps. Always appreciated. I hope you're doing well today. Better roll. <clears throat> I 
Again, though, I'd really like to actually get any attack cards. Some damage? No damage. I can't reach him this turn, but I can at least get another item. One more chance to draw an attack card. And he's gonna be boxed in between me and an enemy. Ideally. Oh, come on! <laughs> he keeps rolling so well. Okay, he's not gonna be boxed in by anything. Never mind. Still no attack cards. <laughs> I should use one of my yellow cards on my next movement, because I think basically no matter what I'm about to path right over the damage trap I just set. I'd love to path around it, but I don't think I don't think I can do that. I can't make that choice. No! It's not what I wanted. cards. Why? I don't feel like I'm asking for too much. Oh, come on. I'm wearing my red polo shirt. Yes. I have, I think, a gray shirt on under it? Yeah, it's a gray shirt. Ooh, I finally drew a red card. I'm doing some damage, but not, not enough. Are you serious? Okay, where does it send me? Cool, I need to walk over a leg trap.
I'm wondering if in the initial character setup, I should settle for plus two movement. Take two movement and give myself three more attack. I don't like the idea of being slower for a speed run, but like, I don't feel like I have a lot of choices. Have I ever ridden a horse? No, I have not. Have you? Has anyone in my chat ever ridden a horse? Everyone here has ridden a horse but me. Uh, I saw a golf. If it's the one that I assume you're talking about, I verified, um... Already forgot their name. Spec? Specs run? A run from them earlier. Also, hello, Code and Joe. I don't think I had seen either of you in chat yet. Calissa spawning two enemies back to back. Told her you would if she would. That's nice, Lucas. <clears throat> good roll. At least I got a good roll. Okay, 11 damage. Let's... Why? <laughs> this dumb game. <sighs> yeah, just attack. Do anything. That's... <sighs> How long is this game? Um, it's gonna take me at least five hours. Probably six or seven. Nobody's done a speedrun of it before, so it's hard to say. It took me a long time to finish a playthrough, but that was without much thinking or forethought. Basically, there's 14 story missions I need to do, and only two of them are hard, and this is one of the hard ones. Only two of them actually require that you fight and beat somebody. All the rest of them, you just need to get an item and get to the exit, and you can just rely on luck for that. But these missions where you actually need to beat somebody, these are... these are really hard. A little scared of larger animals. What about large sheep? Ideal, even. <laughs> Good sheep. Hello, SL Craft. I still have a chance to kill him, I just, <laughs> I just need to get a good hit in. Oh god. That makes this easier. Arya also has low health, but has even lower attack and defense. Where are you warping to? Where are you warping to? Oh my god. We're gonna run out of cards before I can get this item. <sighs> oh, I'm gonna have to reset again. This is a really funny game. 
if I came into this mission with a blue data disk, I wouldn't be able to just, like, walk to the exit with it, right? I actually need to get the data disk that the enemy has. I assume that's the case. I'm pretty sure the game does accurately check which is the target item, Lucas, because when you take items from somebody, it tells you how many points it's worth. And the target item is worth way more than everything else. He's probably gonna die before I can get to him. And he'll warp somewhere, and I don't know where, and now I'm too far out of the way. Wasting time on that. Again, luckily, it's only two missions that are like this. It's level three and level six. Those are the hard ones. Everything else should be relatively easy. I might get unlucky in some of them, but I won't need as much luck as I need for this. Um, SL Craft, I was saying earlier, I, I don't know anything about the rarity of this game, but for years now, I have been just enamored by A1 games. Uh, I, I buy their games every time I see them at my local game shop. And, uh, when I saw this on the shelf, I was really curious what their, uh, their budget RPG was like. <laughs> I've enjoyed it. I, I'm happy I got it. I hadn't heard anybody else talk about this before, but I'm happy I picked this one up. Okay, where are all of we? All of we. That is English. The agent has quite a bit of health again. Health and defense. Lower attack and very low movement, but good amount of health and defense. Please go to me. Thank you. Also, thank you, Golf and Chloe, for contributing to the Hydrate Challenge. How are we doing on that? How many points... How many points are we on that? And Joe, thank you. So appreciated. Don't run. What are you running for? Dude, I'm still faster than you. What are you doing? Less commonly streamed, gotcha. Yeah, I guess that doesn't surprise me. If someone wanted to play a tactics game, there are better ones. <laughs> Defending? Oh, gosh. If I can do any damage, that's really good, though. Good, good. Yeah, you'll try to run. <laughs> Playing Final Fantasy Tactics right now, yeah. Out of curiosity, since you follow lesser streamed games, do you happen to follow the game Hoshigami? For the PS1, and I think that had a remake on the DS. A speedrunner friend of mine um, 
speedruns that, and it's a very cool game that not many people talk about. Gotcha, gotcha. I have no attack cards. <laughs> Again. I'm just gonna defend, I guess. Yeah, attack back. Should be very low. Okay. Um, I'll just type it in the chat. I don't need to do anything for a minute. I think it's that. I'm I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Ollie will be able to do some serious damage to him. That's the real way that you have a chance of doing these missions, is wait until everyone else starts ganging up. Thank you, Chloe. I appreciate it. I saw the cats doing something really cute today that I wish... Uh, my hands weren't full, and I could have taken a picture of. Um, we got a, uh, Joe got a, a cat bed to put in our kitchen window. Um, our kitchen's window, like, sticks out a little bit. It's the kind of window that you're supposed to, like, put, put, uh, plants in to grow. And he got a cat bed and put it in there, and the cats finally started using it. And when I came back from shopping today... Uh, I saw through the window both Toby and Princess were cuddled next to each other in the bed. They are so cute. Oh my god. But my hands were full with groceries so I couldn't take a picture. <laughs> I saw that golf. Yeah, that, uh, that was a wild one. Blessing and a curse. Get a plus seven. This could be it. This could be it. Come on, come on, come on. Big roll. That's not a big roll. That's barely anything. What's my goal for this game? I want to finish a run. <laughs> That's all I want. I expect it to take... I was expecting it to take, like, six hours, but if Mission 3 is gonna be like this, it's gonna take... I don't know, this might be, like, an eight or nine hour run for me. <laughs> I am, Lucas. I actually genuinely am. Um, yeah, fight back. You got a plus eight? Dude. Dude. <laughs> And then I roll nothing. Come on. Okay, I have the escape card. If I can get the target item from him, if we get a little luck here, if Alia can just do... Why are you defending? You have an attack card! Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> I, I need to rest. If I try to fight him, I'm gonna just die. Nothing. Big roll, big roll. Come on, come on, come on. The, we tied again. How did we get two 11s? It's just so easy to end up in a stalemate in this game. Just 
just gonna keep doing that. Oh no, she's gonna stand right in the way! Oh my god. Okay, if I can roll a six, I might be able to get to him. If I roll a six. That is not a six. Yeah, and then you're healing. I know a six when I see one, and that isn't a six. Okay. He only has six health. There's a chance. There is a chance. That's not it. That's not... That's not it. Just heal. I need Alia to do a big chunk of damage, and then I need to hit him. <laughs> right? Uh, I can probably do an attack. Can do two damage? Sure. Just prepping for gone, that's right. Big damage, come on, come on. It's not okay damage. It's okay damage. <coughs> yeah, no, it's a worry. Uh, I think my character's gonna heal, though. No! No! <laughs> Why? You had four health, why didn't you heal? <laughs> Here's the thing about this run, and this is why I have hopes for this as a speed run. This feels very similar to me, uh, something like Yu-Gi-Oh! Forbidden Memories, where it's just so random, you can't ever expect to do well. <laughs> when you do, it's really exciting. And when you don't, all you can do is laugh. <laughs> And I'd like to think that eventually we could come up with a strat that, uh, that makes missions 3 and 6 a little more consistent. I'm just, I, I never play games like this, so I don't, I don't have good instincts for what will work. Oh, he's in there. That's the worst place. And I'm the, no. Uh, yeah, no, I'm not doing that. 
It's gonna take me forever just to get to him. <clears throat> I'm not. I'm not rolling with that mission. But yeah, that's true. FM, you can front load the luck a little bit. Restart the game with the buttons? What do you mean? What? I don't think I ever tried that. I tried a lot of things to quit a mission and never could. That's news to me. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll try that. I'll try that next time. <clears throat> and as for what we're allowed to do, I'm the first person speedrunning this. I can do whatever I want. <laughs> Still no attack cards. I'm gonna try this again tomorrow, and I'm gonna go with two movement at the start of the game. Two movement and give myself more attack. Because this is not working. This is not gonna work. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, that's that's the hesitation with uh, going high movement at all, is there's the risk that you can just walk into a, a leg trap any time, and, and uh, be out of luck. But yeah, I'm thinking this is already going to be a really luck-heavy speedrun, so I might as well just rely on that extra bit of luck and hope I don't hit leg traps. that I didn't know existed until, like, a year ago. I do like ING words where the ING aren't at the end. I am a fan of those. I need to heal. There's no reason to try to fight this monster. <laughs> I 
can check. I can check while the game is running. This is another nice thing about this game as a speedrun, is I can just do other things. Is it me yet? No, it's the monster. Uh, shoeing and winges in the PS1 dictionary. And yeah, hewings in Collins. Not modern North American dictionary, but just Collins. But yeah, shoeing. Or shoeing. Vortex while playing Battle Hunter. <laughs> uh, I already closed Ziziva, but I think it said it's like when you shoo away something. It's an alternate spelling of that. Okay, I think I'm going to try to attack this again. That was a mistake. One shot me. It would be so funny. Close. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna set down a stun trap and then step out of the way. I could go try to attack him right now. I don't think that's worth it. I still don't have a turn. It works. He should go roughly the same direction once he can move again. <laughs> yeah, of course it hits Helga. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Gulf. I'm glad. I appreciate it. Cool. Don't... just... doesn't matter what you do. damage for once. Oh my god. Okay. We're on a we're on a go. Where is the exit? It's to the east. I need to go that way. We have a chance. We have a chance. We just need Helga to not murder us right now. But that's okay cuz I can probably run away. Even if not, I think I'll be fine. Yeah, we're fine. 
Oh! Now we make a run for it. It's fine, we're only losing like 45 minutes on this split. That's okay. It's still good, it's still good. So yeah, my estimate of five-ish hours was when I beat this mission on the first try in my first attempt the other day. And I thought to myself, like, oh, it's not going to be as bad as I thought. And I was wrong. I was wrong. It's exactly as bad as I thought. <laughs> Just get out of that space and let me buy. Thank you. Perfect. Now the only other risk I face, assuming is all uh, is doesn't attack me is that a mob might spawn right in front of me. Like that. Exactly like that. <sighs> and now they're gonna be stunned fighting each other. This stupid game. Yeah, and Helga's still after me, so I am actually in kind of a crunch to get by. Helga has the good AI. I do. I do. My favorite moment in my first playthrough of this was, uh... At one point, I, um... It was a regular mission that I was trying to make money in. Please warp me next to the exit. Warp me closer. Yes! Oh my god! <laughs> the game is nice sometimes. Okay. Um. <laughs> In one of the regular money-making missions, uh, there was one point where I had traveled across the map already to get to the target item. It was the last item left on the map, and it was way out of the way in the corner you had to weave through. And I said, like, oh, thank goodness, finally, I have a chance to get this. And I made my movement, and right as my character started moving, I said, oh, unless I hit a damage trap. And then I hit a damage trap and died and warped across the map. I'm actually going to use my defense cards to move so that I don't hit a trap. I still won that mission for what it's worth. I managed to make it all the way back to the item. There were like two cards left in the deck, and then I drew the exit card and won. It is the only way to the exit, yes. Uh, it is quite a bit to heal to max HP, but if you level up, that also heals you. Which I did not know until I started trying to speedrun this. And so I'm kind of just banking on that instead. Because for the most part, it's not that bad to die. Usually. <laughs> There are cases, obviously if you have the target item, it's very bad to die. But in general, it's not that much of a problem. So I'm not too concerned about, uh... We did it. We did it! Goodness gracious. We only lost 46 minutes. I didn't get anything else in that mission, right? I I don't think I have anything in my inventory right now. Yeah. And I want to say it's like three, 3,500 to level? 
2,500. I can do it right now. Perfect. There. Healed. <laughs> and I will take out our other hunters again and do a couple more rando missions. Yeah, that's a typo golf. It, I tried to make it A, B, and C and just messed up. Sounds pretty cool, yeah. Can I do it again? No. This game. What are you even doing over there, A? Oh, there's an item there. Never mind, you're good. Junk. Oh, uh, wait, is there anything up top? There is. I need this first. Can I reenact the split? Yes. I, uh... No, you saw the only thing that mattered. You saw me get warped next to the exit. That's, that's the only thing that mattered. It was 45 minutes of crying and then that. I keep forgetting that I actually control all the characters now. <laughs> That's not it. Wait, really? You can't get... Oh my god. Um, yeah, just go that way. That's gonna be faster. I would also like you to get this flag, actually. More junk! Come on. Oh, the motion of me physically splitting. Yeah, it went something like... Like that. Did you hear that? I'm not sure that I actually <laughs> set up the sound for that. <laughs> Good, I'm glad. It did not play sound, oh. It was, it was just the Tartrazine sound. You know it. You know the one. Meep, meep, meep. Okay, yes, there's nothing else here. Uh, go grab this item and walk into the exit. Probably, unless it's the target item, of course. Oh, I didn't even notice there was another item right here. By the way, Lucas, did you vote for uh, MMR games yet? <laughs> I finally remembered to do that today. I kept putting it off. Yo, Omni. Thank you, thank you. Play the game faster? No. Can't make me. Oh yeah, you can... Yes, you can vote now. There are multiple games in there that you have speedrun. So your multiple votes allowed will, you know, be useful. Stop attacking me! <laughs> Set a trap here? Yes. Woo! Thank goodness. How do I get the cool item it drops? That's a good point, Golf. That's fair. Um. Yeah, run over and get that item.
And I guess you can run to the exit? It did zero! Oh, let's go. This should kill it. That's a lot of damage. It's already taken quite a bit of damage. Okay. Um... I, I guess I'll fight you because... You're... <laughs> you have an item. You're very slow. Perfect. That actually could not have gone better. <clears throat> There's the target item. Okay. Big roll? Pretty big roll. Red book. Next to a flag, I'll take it. A gun! Let's go. Oh, less nice. Kind of would have preferred that you not spawn next to an enemy, but oh well. Can you trade items between PCs? You can in that uh, you can surrender and give up items. You can't freely trade them. You can, in theory, trade items, but it's slow and hard. Big roll, big roll, come on. Yeah, it's an okay roll. That's a pretty okay roll. Did some damage. These slimes, unfortunately, have a lot of health. And also quite a bit of attack. I'm not actually sure what the fastest way to get over to them are. Uh, just attack. Oh, actually, I should have walked down to the red flag. Oh well. Bunch more damage. Nice. You are attacking me, but that's fine. Yo, Manly. A winner is me, it's true. No, not enough to kill. Ooh, there we go. Okay. this? Um... But I don't feel like I have a whole lot of choice. You can fight it. Lucas has voted. Very good. Okay. Now I can move and take that item from you. The valuable fancy one. I... This is taking too long. I'm just gonna leave. Winner's still getting a decent amount of money from the mission. Uh, I got a gun. 
That's important. Oop, nope, still wanted to sell things. Overall, pretty low value mission, unfortunately. A lot of junk there. Okay, I am... I bet A can level up. A can definitely level up. And A, C can as well. Uh, level up attack a little bit. I need to be able to deal with the, the monsters that come at me. And then it's not super important I level up every- or I save everybody, but Winner in particular, now that he has the gun, I want that. Green Emerald. I wonder if people would be interested in a New Game Plus style speedrun of this. Where you can just come in with three NPCs level 15, give some super good items to your new character immediately. Uh, nothing that way. There is one up this way, yes, go there, go get that. Like, it wouldn't be, you know, a traditional kind of speedrun, but it might just make the game a lot more bearable. It's unfortunate that we got enemies to spawn immediately, but also... They're not attacking Winner, so it doesn't matter much. This is not going to do damage, is it? One damage, okay. You got the item. <sighs> I can't go around. Not easily. Uh, I'll, I'll just leave it to Winner to get that, I guess. It's gonna take you too long to fight that. Oh, you know, one thing I haven't been doing is uh, when I want to give up an item, I should be letting Winner actually attack them. Because that does get me points and therefore money. I'll have you run off this way. And you should run after that extra item. And also heal yourself after you get it, probably. Well, Golf, I can definitely recommend a game. <laughs> An amazing PS1 tactic strategy game.
shame that you don't have a PS1. All is too bad. It's like Chloe. <laughs> Chloe, I'm so sorry. Stay safe. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I will. I haven't... I haven't needed warm clothes for a while. I'm realizing. Just hasn't really come up much. Every time it's been cold outside, I've been able to just stay inside. Ah, uh, yeah, I guess fight again. I need a white girl drunk. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That was the nice thing about AGDQ previously being in Florida. Is, uh, didn't really have to worry about that. Uh, I want you to actually just start running over to Winter. Because you... need to do that. You need to lose your item to him. Right, <laughs> yay! Finally, what is this item? Oh, that's actually okay. I should pass that off to Winter too. <laughs> Big movement, at least? Not enough. Uh, you walk over in here and try attacking, and then you fight back and do a million damage, and you just don't do anything. Fifteen. Let's go. <laughs> Do you have anything good, Player B? No, you have nothing at all, actually. Ah, uh, the monster should run away, though. More or less. Oh, I wanted to step one further. Oh well. Some damage. A lot of damage? A lot of damage. Fifteen again. My goodness. And then I just need to do four damage against AC. Which I should, I think. I hope so. Yeah. Uh, and that should be worth a decent amount of money. Now I want Winner to run to the end. Which... I guess it's best to go up and around? Roll a one, roll a one, roll a one. That's fine. I can work with that. Yeah, the flags, if you roll a one, you can get bad luck.
go. Another mission down. Good amount of points for it. See, the attack bonus this time was 2,500, just for fighting my own guys a few times. And if this was level, like, 3... Oh, what is that? It's like 300 coins or something? Is that enough to level? I don't remember what I need to level next. 4,000, yes. Oh, Tobin. I'm sorry, Joe. Okay. Okay. Oh, wait, no, I still need to sell stuff. Duh. Black outfit was not worth taking. That was not worth very much. Uh, yeah, and I can't level at this point. Another mission. This is the worst dungeon layout, but at least we're pretty far spread out to be able to pick things up relatively easily. It's this spot in particular, the spiral you need to go through. It's nice to have someone starting in there already. Should've used that one. That's a very good item. I want to pick that up. Also a very good one. There's the target. <laughs> cool. Thanks, game. Just run. Don't bother fighting this. when you have no cards. Should do very little? Yeah, zero. Good. And this should do a good amount. Maybe even 12. 13, perfect. Give me that.
Oh, I... I shouldn't have used that. Oh well, I just need to remember that's there. an item down there. Uh, neither of A's items are worth running after. Am I totally wrong? There's the item. That's what I thought. Do I want that crutch? <sighs> it's a pretty good item. I think I want the, uh... I don't remember what it is. The shiny rock. More. <clears throat> that's a better gun. I think that's a better gun. I'm like 20% sure that's a better gun. <laughs> Uh-oh. That's going to, uh, panic him. Oops. You go fight that monster and just block it for a turn. You've got an 8 on you. Yeah, it should do a decent amount of damage. Not remotely enough to take out a slime, but a little bit. Try this again. It'll probably work out. It's more damage than I would have liked to deal, but that's okay. And that's not as much as I would have liked to deal. But it's enough. Never mind. That's exactly as much as I would have liked to deal. Yeah, I want more money. The crutch is nice. It's absolutely nice. But it's not a need to have. Okay, you start running to the exit. I don't want to deal with everything else. Uh, I kind of want you to actually chill over here and give up your gun to Winner. <clears throat> um, try running again, honestly. <laughs> Uh-oh. Yeah, okay. Right, sure. You also try running? Okay. I don't know what I'm gonna do with you. You're kinda in the way of this guy. I guess just fight each other for the sake of it. Doing damage gets you money, so might as well. Stop rolling sixes! Uh, actually, no, fight this one. Please. Uh, 
Um, you chill here. You rest. I what did I just say about rolling sixes? <laughs> okay, this should do nothing at least. Is that enough to probably not enough to kill it? Yeah, not quite. Okay. You fight each other and just give up the gun. I think there's a flag down here you can go after? Just to give you something to do? This slime has rolled a six three times in a row. Outrageous. Good, and then I should be able to get to the exit on this turn. Despite the game's best efforts of throwing more ones at my at my movement, I got there eventually. <sighs> okay. Um I have things to sell. I want to look at that gun. Is that a better gun? What? You you have? What? No you didn't. You're lying. Okay, first of all, no, it's not a better gun. Why does he think he looked at that already? That's wrong, right? I never... I never looked at this gun. Strange. Very strange. Sure, I have another gun, that's fine. Sell that one. <clears throat> okay. Now we have money. Uh, winner should be able to go up to level six. Other people should also be able to level. You can't, but B can. Oh, and I suppose C can't either. Never mind. Okay. We have grinded to level 6. We saved time! Thank you. 
Okay. Back to story missions for a little bit. I'm not going to be Vakif in a fight. That's not happening. I need to get good at other mashing techniques. I know there's a lot of ways that you can mash a button. But I just never try to very much. I never... It's not a skill that I've ever cared to develop. Are you serious? <laughs> No. I'm gonna get some water. Princess. Stuck into my room. I wish the camera was pointed at the floor. She is so cute. Oh my god. As soon as I stood over her, she did the cat flop. Do this? Why? That's three in a row where Vakif has been able to get the item on the first or second turn. Is there actually a pattern to this mission? Have I just been getting lucky in the past? Is the target item generally the one that spawns closest to Vakif?
I mean, in this mission, in, in mission four. Not in general, obviously. Oh, also, I was forgetting to try the button combo. I, I gotta try that on the next one. Because that would be quite a lot faster than, uh, than what I was doing. Resetting the console definitely takes a while. <clears throat> you were asked a question in a different stream. What is the weirdest gift you've ever gotten for me? That's a good question. Why am I fighting Robocop? Mad Rax? Goodness. Um... It's hard to say. It's really hard to say. The Japanese B-movie poster was really good. Probably that one. It was Ball Breakers, I think is the one you're thinking of. I still need to play that. It's on my shelf. I think about it still. Okay, there's not something to that pattern. It was just bad coincidence that the Keef kept getting the item. It does work. Shoulder button, start select, it does work. I will. I definitely will. Uh, thank you, I think it was Gene who suggested I try that. <laughs> thank you. me playing golf. Back to GTA 5, gotcha. What do you got going on there? What are you trying to accomplish at the moment in GTA 5? Right, but like, what mission do you have up next? <clears throat> Am I better off running into the exit? Maybe I am. 
actually. This is not a great start for me. Close to a really good spot, but oh well. close to anything. I'm kind of close to those. I can go there. Monster spawned, but at least it's behind me. Never mind. enough to get the item. Oh well. Okay, that helps a little bit. If I roll well, I might still be able to get both of these items. Classic GTA. Just get a big movement right now. Very good. Snag this. And then they probably won't be able to get the other one. Unless they roll a freaking six. Yellow Game Boy! That's the good Game Boy! Oh, I wish I got that actually. <laughs> Dang. Well, here. <sighs> I wanted to use that plus three. Oh well. I might be able to take Tatum in a fight. I shouldn't reset yet. Shuichi is just getting demolished here, though. Good. great way over to him. Does not help when I roll a 1 as well.
I'll just stand here. That'll block his path at least. can start hitting him. <laughs> Decent amount of damage. You're probably gonna do quite a bit to me though, huh? Yeah. That's fine. The Keef will hit you for quite a bit more, and then on your turn... Probably gonna heal, I would guess. You're gonna heal after that. need to hope that I can roll well. It's a roll okay, but that's not... Oh! Never mind, we're good. I think I should run. That's... I think that's the play right now. <laughs> walk right into it. I hate you. <laughs> right, he picked up the yellow Game Boy, didn't he? Oh, well. Oh, that's so much damage. Okay, okay. I will probably be able to get to the exit next turn anyway. Uh, maybe not, probably. Yeah. Okay, okay. We get to be in danger now. <laughs> oh. Thank goodness. Shuichi could also attack me, though. Oh, and he will. Oh, god. <sighs> okay. Luck, come on. No. One tile from the exit. That is a rough one. My goodness.
At least I'm starting next to a bunch of items this time. Hopefully one of them is the, the target. Did it, Golf? How so? Interesting, interesting. <laughs> the story going on that conveyed that message. I never played GTA 5, so I, I don't know. I want to murder two fake Border Patrol agents who talked you in racial profiling innocent civilians, I see. Well, yeah, but like the story of the side missions, I mean... It's not the item that I can get on this next turn, or the turn after. I should probably reset again. I don't think it's worth running around here hoping I can beat Vakif to the next one. Somehow. That's a really good item, though. Oh, that's rough. I need to try to finish this, actually. That, um, that's kind of an important item. Okay. The target item is next to Vakif, who is fighting this for a while. I don't think he's going to kill it anytime soon. I don't think he's done much damage to it. No, he's done quite a bit of damage to it. He's killed it. Never mind. Vakif's about to get the item. <laughs> And I'm stunned again, I forgot about that. Two of my items were on stun traps. <sighs> I should try. I gotta try on this one. Yeah, no, Vice City is the only one I ever really played any of. chance to one-shot Vakif. I could kill him and get the item. It's possible. <laughs> gotcha. That's funny. Let's 
just stand right in his way. And he'll just walk around us. Okay. <laughs> 13 damage. Potentially needs 17 if he... Uh... He uses that card. Which he does. Okay, how do we do? Not remotely enough. That's nothing. Oh, that is sad. Yeah, fight back. Okay, that's... That should be fine. Yeah. And then I still have a chance to do some damage. Maybe. A little. Little damage. And Shuichi's probably about to run into my trap. Yeah. I was kinda hoping Vakif would run around me into it, but I should have expected that. Okay. Okay. I have a chance. Six damage. Six damage. That should be six. That should be fine. <sighs> okay. Now I just need Shuichi to not kill me. Unfortunately, he's got really good movement, so I can't exactly run away from him easily. I think I just need to try... <sighs> okay. Okay. It didn't do enough. It hurt, but it didn't do enough. Now I just need to bolt to the exit and hope for the best. That's not helpful. My god. again and hope for the best? I'm dead. I'm not dead! Oh, I thought that was a higher roll! Okay, I got one more chance. Nope, I win. Oh, this is so good. Oh my god, you have no idea how good this is. If I'm correct, the book that I picked up in that mission is Folklore. And this is like a, a magic book for the speedrun. It is. It is. Oh my god. If I'm right, I think we're kind of going to be set for the last split. It'll take some time to set up, but we're in a really good position all of a sudden. Um, and save again immediately. Oh my god. So here's the thing about the item I picked up, Folklore. It makes it so that enemies won't spawn next to you after your movement. And that's great for me. The reason that is magical for the speedrun is you can duplicate items really easily in this. So I can give it to everybody. I can give it to all four of my characters and all of a sudden nobody will spawn monsters anymore. Missions will just fly by, comparatively, to, to what they would otherwise. Because <laughs> battles, far and away, take up the most time in this. This means I can just waste time getting flags, which get a bunch of points, which get a bunch of money. Uh, just indefinitely, I think. There's so much that Folklore does. 
Um, where is another item? I guess I need to just go this way. I don't really have a lot of options. That was the only one I spawned next to. be able to take her in a fight. She's probably just gonna keep trying to run from me. But I might be able to, uh, to win. Her speed isn't that much higher than mine, fortunately. Um, I'm gonna stand here. Try to run, yes. And you're gonna roll the 12, sure, why not? Good. Try to run again, I kind of expected as much. Much better. Still not that much damage, though. Could have done a little bit better on that front. Are you serious? Six. Cool. Good game. <laughs> oh my god. I wanted to catch up on Discord real quick, but there's been a ton of messages since I last checked. terribly close to anything. Oh, I should have used the trap card. Uh -oh. I saw that one before. Neat. It's a new item to me.
There's one other item I have a chance of getting, I think. And if it's not that one, then I should probably reset again. It's just... that one, really. Yeah, I'm too far away from the rest. Honestly, I might even be too far away from that one. It's very far, considering I need to spiral inward. Honestly, this is taking too long. <laughs> Two enemies are out. My leg is broken, so it's taking forever to get anywhere. It's better to just reset at that point. Starting near a couple. I might be able to get one of these. I assume Harm will get the other very close to it. Or not. Okay. Surprises me, but okay. Steak fries are really good. I I agree, Lucas. I agree I think I agree that they're underrated. I think there are other fries that I might often enjoy more. Um, but those fries are already talked up a lot. Yeah, steak fries are great. me for? What did I do? I'm gonna just give up one of these items. I think I should. I don't need this. Send me somewhere better. Like there, yes. Oh my god, yes. Got another one. Fantastic.
I love Azabar's stats. One movement attack and defense, and then 48 health. Uh, all of the other items are up for Azabar, so I need to get a move on that way. And I'm probably just going to surrender that dollhouse again. I don't think it's worth my time trying to defend against this. Or you're just going to stand right in my way. <laughs> Just giving these items away. No, actually, if I rest for a turn, I should be able to get around and uh, probably get one of those. I got a chance. I got a chance if the way things are. sells for. Is this gonna kill me? Yes. I wonder if it's worth using folklore as a means to evade enemies, or if I should just be duping a bunch of folklore and, um, and just selling that. No, not folklore the PS3 exclusive video game. Folklore, the book in my inventory that stops stops um, encounters from happening. I can check. I can check folklore right now. Two fifty? Are you kidding? Why is it so cheap? Ridiculous. Quite possibly one of the best items in the game. It sells for 250. That's five copies of the PS3 exclusive folklore. Um. <clears throat> yeah, you're gonna get those before me, so I'll go up top. Yo, Shishidar. You're not gonna get those before me because you're gonna ignore items. Okay. Yeah, this has been uh, this has been a fun one. Frustrating, but it's still been a fun one. I've been enjoying it. A hey, cornflower. That's true. That's true. Floor is public domain. Therefore, it's just not worth very much. That makes sense. Um, I. I didn't enjoy this casually for most of it. It took me a long time to start enjoying it. But a lot of what drove me to keep playing it is that I think it's going to be a really funny speedrun. It's just so disgustingly luck based. But it's the good kind of luck in a speedrun where you're still needing to make a ton of decisions based on that. So the better players should, on average, come out on top. Ooh, a good item, too. And I broke my leg. Neat. Love it. So yeah, I, uh, I got a lot of problems with it. I would never call this a great game. Uh, but there's things I like about it. There are things I like about it. Ooh, 
what is my path back? I think it's gonna be that way. I think it has to be that way. <sighs> I have the target item. I have nine attack. I can give up items if I get attacked. I should be fine. Suddenly regretting not keeping that crutch earlier. I kind of do hope somebody attacks me, because if I give up an item and warp, it fixes my leg. So even if it did warp me backwards, it would uh, <laughs> likely be for the best anyway. Give me three more movement per turn. save like five rounds of going to the exit or something. is worth it in this. I'm kind of leaning towards yes, but that might just be because of what's happening right now. I did keep one in my inventory for most of... Oh, and you got the exit card. For most of my casual playthrough. Zir should run into a trap regardless of which way she takes. That's nice. The problem is if I have a crutch and a weapon and folklore in my inventory, that's suddenly three slots that are taken up constantly. And that's not good. Oh no, nine damage! I'm just gonna fight it again. I should have moved. I gotta remember to move and then fight it. It's a small thing, but you do... Oh, that's worth a lot of money. Uh, you do get points and therefore money if you move. So I, I gotta remember, if I'm gonna fight something that's next to me, I should just move around a little bit and then fight, just to get those little extra points. I say that not being remotely certain if that's worth doing, if that's worth my time. I don't actually know, I just hope it is. said, haha at her, but I really like some movement cards. It would make things a lot better for me right now. That enemy is gonna go a long way around, I think? Yeah. Good. That six is nice. I appreciate that. I 
wonder if Kenross is moving towards me. I don't think so. I think he was just wandering before. Damage trap? Electric trap, okay. Or stun trap, rather. No, that is an empty trap, yes. E for empty slash electric. That's a stun trap. Dude, what are you doing? What do you think you're doing? Um... This is the only safe option. Nice. Okay, I'll take that. And then I need to hope that that enemy rolls low, I think. I could probably get around it regardless, but hopefully the enemy just rolls low. That's not as low as I would like, but it works. Sneak. Very good. Okay, that's mission five. We have a couple of very valuable things to sell. Three thousand! Oh my goodness. What luck. <laughs> the Great Train Robbery? Very nice. Fun. Okay. Um, I could probably afford to level up again. Do I want to? No, I don't. I'll just try the mission. If I go with this a bit and I'm struggling, I, I might try to level up one more time and then do the mission. See if that one extra attack gets me anything. <clears throat> I am on the opposite side of the arena as the thief. I'm not doing that. <laughs> No thank you. I'm glad they put that in golf. That is, that is really nice. Sorry, where are we? Oh, I'm next to him. Very cool. And he's got high attack, but low-ish defense and low health. And I, unfortunately, have no attack cards. <laughs> Some damage, though. I'm getting a start on him. It's not ideal. Only a little damage, though. Okay, we'll see what happens on his turn. He may attack me, and I may... We'll see. We'll see what happens. Not healed. Okay.
you're running. Why? <laughs> okay, well, at least that enemy's gonna do some damage to him. Do I have a chance of drawing an attack card? I, I don't remember how many I had in my hand just now. No, I don't. We'll see what happens. No, he's running away from this. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Of all the luck. I, I felt like I was being so clever. Like, I'm gonna go stand in front of him. He's gonna have to move around me. Waste all that space. No, I hit a stun trap. Yeah, and of course he's attacking the stunned guy. Ridiculous. Oh? What food was it? <laughs> now would be a great time for me to attack him. Too bad I can't. No, that tracks. That probably would have happened to me, too. Is he next to the exit? I don't remember exactly where the exit is. No, he's not close to the exit. Where is it? It's way up there. Okay. So no, he's not really in a great position. Carolina gold sauce from Chicken Bones, yeah. That is a really good sauce, I gotta say. I've gotten a similar kind of sauce from the store, but, uh... I don't know what it is. The Chicken Bones sauce, it is better. Goodness, I can move again. Move up. No. Very surprised Vikif chose to move there. He also laid down a trap, which is going to be a problem in a second. Other hunters are really doing their best to just get beat up. I 
I don't know why they're so so set on killing this slime. Honestly, I should have gone around the other way. It, uh, it was a mistake to try to follow directly after him. Oh well. That should kill it. I was going to walk through a trap there. That worries me that I didn't. Right. Shuichi has less defense, though. So maybe that's a good thing? <laughs> oh my god. The... The Beef's Agent drew the escape card this turn, so we're actually very lucky that Shuichi just did that. <laughs> oh, come on! <laughs> I have 50% evasion! set another trap along this path too, so when it is my turn I should use another evasion card. Oh, where are you go? How can you tell? Evasion does nothing! If only has one defense and 11 health, I might be able to take him too. At least I can move this turn. Now I just need to draw a nice attack card, and I have a chance of winning. I have a chance of... We'll see. Hold on, we'll see. Okay, no, you're defending. Yeah. We'll see what happens. I 
don't need to do that much damage. Also, he drew the other escape card. So there's no chance of that coming up. Got a defense card. I can swing with that. That's not remotely enough. Yeah, doesn't really matter what happens when I draw or when I roll bad like that. No, that's too far away. And we're too close to the end of the mission. <sighs> it's too bad. We were close. We were close. It's not like the first beat a guy up mission where I just felt like I had no chance for so long. That one was very close. Here's the guy. Oh, there's me. Okay. He's got high defense. Ugh. And I have no attack. We'll see. Maybe Shuichi can help me. Oh, I got some attack. Okay. I have a chance. Chance to do some damage. Little damage. Uh, S doubles your attack. So that turn I had 18 attack. And the C card adds your attack to your opponent's attack. So C card is situationally good. close to the end. Yep. Yep, Infinity Gene's suggestion was right. I'm glad he said something, because I, uh... <laughs> I tried for a while and was very frustrated that there didn't seem to be a way to quit out of fights. So it's nice to see that's not true. There is something... The game just doesn't tell you that anywhere, even in the manual. <laughs> I'm on the opposite side of the arena of him. He's got even higher defense. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna play with that. Ancient Cosmographer, thank you for the raid. You have five crap. Hey, Harrow and Birds. Howdy, howdy, one and all. We're doing a very silly speed run. I think this run relies more on luck than any other speed run I've ever done.
Uh, although this should be, in theory, the last hard part of it. The, the premise of this game is simple. Every level, you end up on a randomly generated dungeon floor, and there's some item that you need to get and take to the exit. That is how you do every level. But there are two missions in the game where somebody else starts with the item. Four defense again! Oh my god. It's this guy. Uh, the BPHS. I need to beat him up and take an item he has. And he has four defense, which is an outrageous amount. Um, there's only two missions where you need to do that. And those are the hard ones. Because this game... It balances defense quite a bit over offense. Um, so fights frequently just end up in stalemates. And so you kind of need to just get really lucky to be able to win. But after this mission, we're in the clear. We just do a bunch of missions where we need to hope that we spawn close to the target item and then can win. I was expecting this to take, like, at least five hours. And at the rate this has been going, I'm thinking this might take closer to, like, eight hours. <laughs> Nobody has speedrun this before, though. So this is, uh, this is all new territory. We're figuring things out. I appreciate what you just did. That actually helps a lot. Yes, I am on world record base. Despite the split saying that I'm more than an hour behind the partial run I did, I am technically on world record base. Are you gonna kill him, really? Oh my god, Shuichi, you're amazing. I mean, now I need to fight Shuichi, which is not going to be easy. Uh, he has a lot of health and very good attack, but I got a chance. <clears throat> That's not hurting. <laughs> Or it's doing very little. Yeah, six damage. I, I panicked him, though, so he's gonna do a random action. We'll see what happens. I'm not feeling great about my odds here, but I might be a... That's really bad. God damn this. Because he moved in there, this enemy is gonna follow him in, which means I can't attack him until the enemy's out of the way. This is a weak enemy, though. He might take it out on this hit. We'll see. These, uh, these little floor drone things, they have relatively low defense and health. I'm not really sure what they even try to do to make up for it. They don't have really high attack either. And their movement's only okay. I, I don't know what those floor drones do. I forget what they're called. All the There's only a few monster types and they all have names, but... I don't know. This one might be bot? Or bro? I don't remember. So anyway, yeah, this has been... This has been a game. I, I was playing it recently. Um, I did a, a casual playthrough over a few weeks on stream. And it was a bit of a slog to get through, but... I had hope that it is decently speedrunnable. Okay, let's take you out, or at least try to do something. That should be a decent amount of damage. This might do it. That was only nine damage. That is not a decent amount of damage, and it's gonna stun me. Cool. The funny thing about this game, I know I said it's very random, it's not just that there's a lot of luck involved. It's that they didn't seem to make any effort to balance the luck. It can totally happen that you start a mission and it's just impossible to win. You know, somebody else starts next to the target item and the exit and they just win in two turns and you never had a chance. 
That happens more than I would like. So it's just, it's really silly in that way. I have a plus nine to attack right now. If you don't run, you're not running. I have a chance. I think that's it. Yes, okay, okay. That's the target item. You have two Game Boys? Oh my God, you're so lucky, Shuichi. Now I just need to get to the exit, which is not exactly easy. The other guys are after me too. <laughs> But I have the item. That's the important step. That's the step that always has me worried. I think the exit was this way? Way down there. Should I go down, maybe? I think I should. And Shuichi has the same... <sighs> That's not a good roll. I don't think Shuichi could block me here. I think I'm fine that way. Suichi has the same speed as me, so he'll be able to catch up pretty fast. And of course he drew a plus two. Okay, but he only rolled a one. We're fine. <gasps> I could draw the escape card, yes. There is there are two cards in the deck that just warp you straight to the exit. Uh, also, since Suichi's going that way, maybe I should go this way. He's gonna catch up to me no matter what. I, I can't outrun him at this point. Yeah, let's go this way. I can at least leave a trap behind me, but he does have a Game Boy on him, so one in four chance he'll just avoid the trap anyway. Um, I don't want to fight you, because if I try, you'll probably just do a bunch of damage to me. I outran him, that's fine. Now I can leave a leg trap behind me, and hopefully he'll just walk into it. <laughs> Poor Beef's agent. Damage trap into mob spawn. Uh, if Shuichi walks into the leg trap, his movement drops to zero instead of three. And so I'll be able to pretty easily outrun him after that. But he needs to hit the trap, which is not a guarantee. And given my luck in this game, it's <laughs> very unlikely. Uh, actually, I want this flag. I'll take it. Gives me some extra money. And I do need money to level up. Yes! Oh my god, okay. I think... I think... We're basically in the clear? We could still hit damage traps. We're still in risk of damage traps. I think that's the only thing I'm worried about, though. <clears throat> Shuichi is extremely unlikely to catch up to me. Um, nobody else is close to me. If Fakif just rolls like constant sixes, he might be able to catch me, but that's not likely either. I'm feeling pretty good. And the exciting thing is, after this, we get to go to the most interesting part of the run, in my opinion. Uh, which is the last leveling grind. <laughs> because I don't know the optimal way to do that. I have no idea. I have some guesses, but... But we'll see. We'll see what happens. Punk. Okay, should be this turn. Not gonna be greedy and go for that item, I'm just gonna finish. <laughs> that is level six. My goodness. <sighs> okay. Did I pick up anything else? Yes, I have something else to sell. Okay, 
So all of that happened. I have a whole bunch of money. I should just level up now, honestly. I, I have one level I can pay for. Uh, and everything else is just going into movement. I, I don't need to level up anything after that. Okay. There's a tricky thing that I want to take care of now. I have this book in my inventory called Folklore. I want to give it to the other players. And that's tricky to do. Uh, because it basically means I'm sacrificing a round where I just don't get anything. Uh, no money, no items, nothing. I do want to level up the other characters a little bit anyway. So, that's not the end of the world. Uh, but I also need to do two rounds of this. Here's the thing, this book, Folklore, it makes it so that monsters don't spawn next to you. And if everybody has it, that means that monsters don't spawn next to anyone. And that's a good thing. That's a really good thing. <laughs> so, uh, we did that, we saved, we loaded the other characters, we're gonna start a mission. And in this one, Winner is not gonna finish. He can give up his gun, he can give up folklore. Um, because after this we're just gonna kick him out and reload the character. I, this is gonna be a good mission for all the other characters we have. What is in this box? These guys all spawned pretty close to each other, that's unfortunate. This is actually a really gross layout. Why is this so snaky? Uh, there's a few items over there. You'll get those. There isn't that much to this game. There is a face in the top left. I did see that. There isn't that much to this game. Uh, th you're not gonna get anything out of that. Just fight him, surrender, give up full floor. Um, but if anybody has any questions, is what I was gonna say, just let me know. Because I've, I've been explaining things in a pretty scattered way. So if anyone has any specific questions about what's actually going on, let me know. junk bottle. Okay. Uh, I do want you to get that item if possible. Oh, it's one of these guys. That's not ideal. These are the tough monsters. I don't like them. I don't I don't want to fight them. <laughs> it does seem like they shot me in the face. They it kind of did. Yeah. Oh, no, that's what I wanted. Okay, that's fine. Let's, uh... Are there any other items down here that you can get? Not really. The exit's over here, though. Oh, that's so gross. I guess you're gonna go down that way. Um, you... And go over here and just hit a damage trap, sure. <laughs> Why not? You get a bunch of points. You get no points and possibly stunned. Definitely stunned for a turn, sure. Why not? Like I have said, this game is just brutal. Oh, that's right, you were moving randomly. You're attacking me again. That's fine. Just... whatever. <laughs> Dead! That's okay. Dying isn't that bad. It just... 
It halves your max health and sends you to a random point in the map. It's not a big deal. You've got a decent attack card. Go ahead and try to damage it. Never mind. Just roll really bad, sure. It's not entirely his fault. I, he does only have two attack. That's very low. He never had much of a chance to begin with. Um, I want you to give up an item to somebody. Give up your gun, just because it sells for a decent amount. Maybe to player B. Or AC, I guess. Wait, which one? I don't remember what the target item was anymore. I don't know who's supposed to be going to the end. I think B is supposed to be going to the end right now. B, I want to get the other items and get to the end. Oh wait, that's that path does not wrap around the way I thought it did. Oh well. this item. You go around and get the other item. Uh, and then you go fight this, I think. You have good attack. You might be able to do some damage to it. Maybe. Nope, not if you roll like that. I mean, you did some damage to it, but... Not as much as would be helpful. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> that wasn't my plan. Player A can get the extra gun and sell it. That's, that's the new plan. You... Attack this slime, I guess? gonna be remotely enough. These slimes have too much defense. All good, Joe. Uh, I guess player B should just run around the other way? I don't really see you having much of an option. This slime is just too much in the way. You go attack player winner. You surrender and give up your gun. Hey, you're somewhere better now. Okay. You grab this flag, get the points. Vacuuming. Imagine. Imagine a world. You can't... You can't be done. Fact. No one has ever imagined anything before. You can't dispute it because that's a fact. I have no idea what the best plan is at this point. These monsters spawned in really unfortunate places. Everyone else, you guys don't need to do anything. You, I think, just need to run around. Um, honestly, you also just rest. You should follow. Yeah, you will. Good. You're probably also gonna try getting in here. Uh, you, I kinda want 
to track and try to hit the slime, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. I'm just trying to get player B to the exit now. in a world it can't be done. John Lennon. Absolutely. <laughs> okay, I should win on the next turn. This is taking a while for something that isn't going to level up winner at all, but I I really think this is going to be worth it. That was just a funny bit. It's a really loud vacuum. <laughs> um, so real quick, eh, it's not worth the extra turn. Just go to the end. Never mind, you can't go to the end anyway. How many beetles can I name? Um, let's see, there's Philly, there's Polly G, there's Doc, of course. <laughs> you draw the escape card. Um,. There's Lake Superior. Um, okay, I need to actually think for a second. I need to remove you and then load you back in. Perfect. Now two of us have folklore. And then I need to go to this guy, and I need to not take this mission, that's not what I'm doing. I know that's not what I meant to do either. I need to change character and then identify <laughs> and identify folklore. Good. And then I need to sell the gun and the dollhouse because I don't need either of those. Okay. And then sell everything else everyone has. I start actually trying to remember beetles. <laughs> No, I don't know beetles very well. I can only name four of them. Uh, and we have money to level people up, I think. A little bit. We should. Not you. You don't have enough to level up, but you do. Uh, and everybody just take movement. Everybody just take movement. Yeah, see, I can never remember Pete Best's name. <laughs> Horns, once you watch The Simpsons, I can tell you uh, that Apu was a beetle, and you'll laugh and say, I remember that joke. So be prepared for that, for when you eventually watch The Simpsons. You'll need to watch a lot of it, though. I think they make that joke in Season 7. Okay. I think I'm good. Now I need to do another round of this, except both Winner and A are gonna get lost. I, I don't need either of them to finish. So B and AC need to get Folklore and the target item.
Um, yeah, just move right up to whoever this is. Am I close enough for an item, actually? No. So just move up to next to whoever this is. Yeah. You're A. Uh, so you won't need to finish. You're B. So you're gonna take Folklore. Ooh, you spawned in a good spot. Nice. And you're AC, so you need to take Folklore from A. so much. It's such a good one. <laughs> okay, good. You have the target item. So I just need to get A over to AC. Recently, nice, very nice. <laughs> uh, just attack, actually. I don't need you to do anything else. Me <laughs> interviewing horns for a job interview. <laughs> There are... <laughs> You're kidding! I'm sorry, the fact that I picked up another Folklore matters. Um, that means A can... Or that means Winner can still finish. So, <laughs> that changes things a little bit. That changes things just a little bit. Uh, that means I want to give Winner the target item. I also want to give Winner full floor, and I'm only going to be resetting A on this, this mission. Let's start by getting you... I wanted to get that flag, not just stand there randomly. It's fine, it'll take a few turns, but we'll get there. good if they had enemy spawned. That's fine, we'll make it work. Uh, you need to go, like, there. You... It's a rad. That's a slime. I, I have no idea what the best thing for you to do is. Move just, like, over here. Okay, I want you to attack this guy. I want you to surrender and give up one of your folklore. For the eagles. Right. I think Don Henley is the only eagle I can name. I don't know who Philly is. Oh, that's the, the team, isn't it? The Philadelphia Eagles. Is that a team? Is that some kind of sports team? <laughs> Is it not the Philadelphia Beatles? You spawned up there. I want you to give your folklore back to Winner. That's where you're going now. Uh, what is the best path? This is the best path. Player... 
nothing you do matters, AC, you already have your folklore, just chill, dude. Just chill out, man. Cool your jets, broski. <laughs> you know how I normally talk. <laughs> what is broski getting added to the Scrabble Dictionary? I don't know, maybe it already is. <laughs> there are more items down here, you should probably try to get those. <laughs> you already have folklore, so chill out. <laughs> Good old Lucas. I'm attacking you for folklore. Right, okay. Yes, there we go. You are also close to these items. But I don't want you to be. You're A. You're gonna get overwritten. You stay there. You go after the items. Oh, one of them is actually really far away. Crud. You don't do anything, you also don't do anything, you move. It's fine, you can still get two pretty good items. read your hand, but that's fine. Ooh, a dagger, that's not bad. <clears throat> Hopefully you'll be able to just finish, which you will. Okay. Okay, we should be in a pretty good spot now. Now we're gonna remove A and reload A back in. Yes? Yes. Remove, load, A. Everybody has folklore, monsters can no longer spawn at all. Uh, and then I'm gonna sell all this extra stuff that I, I don't need. Uh, and then I'm gonna save everybody's... Just gonna save everybody. <laughs> yes. The coat. Nope, still on this character. The disc. I'm gonna be so paranoid about accidentally selling folklore. <laughs> no, don't sell folklore, stop it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, can I level anybody up? I can level up AC, definitely. I can't level up Winner yet. But I can level up AC. Perfect. Okay, now I'm gonna save. You're not supposed to be that one. Dang it! <laughs> I saved in the wrong slot. It doesn't matter, but I did save in the wrong slot. I'm not gonna take that. <sighs> okay. Good. 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 Now, I think we can pretty safely just run around in missions for a while.
What level am I currently? Seven. Why are you disappointed, Golf? Oh, what mission level is this one? Um, it's an average of some numbers, so I'm not actually entirely sure. I'm, I don't want you to get that item. I want you to just run off. The only people who should be picking up items are the ones who are trying to deliver the good items to winner. I was wrong about how this works. Why did that happen? You, I didn't identify it. I didn't identify it for everybody. That's why. I'm a bozo. It's fine, we can have one normal mission. And then we'll fix it. Next mission is gonna be the good one. <laughs> It's okay. We'll get there. Yeah, just honestly run away from that. I don't know where the other items are, though. I picked up all the ones I've already seen. Where am I going? There's two items down there. One up there. One up there. Okay, okay. You go for the bottom items. <laughs> it's a good one, Lucas. It is. You go for the top item. Unfortunate, but you keep going for the top item. You go for the other top item. And you also go for that one, and you two can race and see who gets there first. I haven't made a Wazowski emote in so long. It's, uh, it's honestly just really shameful. <laughs> shameful that I, I haven't kept up the practice. happy with everything I did related to that. Oh, I thought that wrapped around. Oh well. Okay, so that guy's gonna pick up some flags. You're probably gonna die right now might not die, but you're probably gonna die right now. It's a good amount of damage. So many traps. That's the next thing I need to figure out how to avoid. Okay, yeah, you just go for these flags. That is the target item. Okay. Um, maybe I'll just let that monster kill him, because he's bound to spawn closer to winner in that case. Uh, yeah, just try to fight back. Good luck with that. Oh, that didn't actually mean good luck. I kind of wanted you to take a bunch of damage. isn't worth very much. Okay. Get this other flag. I think after this, you two can just start resting. Somewhere random, hopefully close to winter. 
That is not particularly close to winter. <laughs> uh, actually, maybe you guys should go beat him up? Maybe. What items does everybody have? Somebody has something good. A has something pretty good right now. Why did I place a trap there? I wasn't thinking. Winner actually has a lot of really good items right now. Kind of thinking it wouldn't be so bad if A just finished. Or not A, uh, whoever this is, AC just finished. Why am I fighting you? You can just surrender. It doesn't matter. Um, yeah, move, I guess. Try to get, try to get stomped by this enemy. Uh, yeah, and try and fail to fight back. There we go. And where does it spawn me? That's not a helpful place to spawn. That's such an unhelpful place. Okay, you can start going back. You can't do anything helpful, actually. Both of you just stop. Actually, yeah, everyone except AC stop, I think. Good. And then it basically has to spawn me closer. That's better. That is arguably better. Um, yeah, I can take that from you. I'll, I'll go after him. <laughs> I'm glad we're getting a lot of mileage out of my typo. <laughs> I don't think you can win this. I'm pretty sure I auto win. Like 14 damage, there's no way. Uh, this was the target item. Give that up. <sighs> okay, next turn we win.
Very good. Decent amount of points from people. Okay. Let's actually inspect all of these now. <laughs> like I was supposed to to begin with. I think I did it with you also, but just to... Yes, okay, good. Now everybody sell your extra junk. I'm actually not sure the gun is even worth having anymore. Plus one attack isn't very much when I'm already doing quite a bit. I'll keep it. It's on the rare side for me to want to hold on to that many items at once. <clears throat> 4,000 to level up. Okay. So none of the rest of you can. That's fine. Not new. Save. Save now that everybody's actually identified the item. Saving is mostly going to be a waste of time. Um, I guess it's mostly just I, I want to keep doing it in case the game crashes or something. It hasn't crashed on me yet, but you never know. You never know what's going to happen with this game. So I just I want to do it every so often. Okay, now we should be in a pretty good spot. Never. Couldn't happen. you guys are in kind of a bad place. Sure. flags up there. All the other items are down that way. Okay. Cyvalian's pretty dang good. I, I did enjoy that. I was reluctant to give it a try just because it looked like a relatively hard game and I never really play Super Nintendo games anymore. But Jacobo was right. It's a really beginner-friendly speedrun. I think I said in the video description, I did a first playthrough, which took about 10 minutes, and then I did my first speedrun, which took a little less than 10 minutes. It's, it's a good one. Another folklore! Why am I getting so many folklore? Super Nintendo games? Yeah. That is good. 
What do you have right now, eh? I want to hand over that gold band. Do you have left to that you want to do? I shouldn't have placed a trap there. <laughs> gun too honestly not sure <laughs> all the scrabble tiles yeah golf oh my god big one there's the item Spawn. Oh, wait. Oh, sh I didn't mean to do that. I wasn't thinking. I need to go get that back. Oops. Cannot give up folklore. That's that's not an okay an okay choice. Okay, now you surrender and give up one of your folklore. <laughs> Everyone else just stop moving. We don't need to deal with this. We can go finish this. Winner has a bunch of stuff. Winner can just run to the exit now. Unless he hits a trap soon. Like there. That was actually a fine one to hit. I'm good with that.
Oof. <sighs> Pretty good points. Decent flag bonus, good item bonus. The somewhat important thing is as the mission levels get higher, points are getting me more money. How much is this worth? 1500 Oh my goodness. I wonder what that is. It's probably just some valuable thing. It doesn't matter. This is worth 500 That's only going to be attack plus one. That's what I was wondering about. Where's everyone's money? Ah, uh, you can level up, eh? Jacobo! Thank you for the raid! Ah, uh, you're the only one who can level up because it's 5,000. How much do you need? 15. It'll take a little bit. We're in... I want to call it the home stretch, but it's gonna be, like, more than half the run. <laughs> Currently 1545 people on my leaderboard? Hell yeah. Um, so I did, like, the start of a run the other day. Here's the thing about this game. There's basically two difficult story missions. It's only two. Um, it's those two missions, and then everything else should be relatively painless. Not easy, exactly, but relative to those two, they're easier. Actually, I want to get this flag. That's unfortunate, but oh well. Um, and so the partial run I did the other day was through those missions, and as you can see, this run is an hour and a half behind that pace. Uh, it was really bad. <laughs> it was really bad. Well done, AC. Um, but we're through it, and now we get to do the rest of the game. <laughs> I did get really lucky with something, though. Uh, something that I did not expect to happen at all, and I'm so surprised it did. There, uh, yes, I did also get a couple of golds on the, the grinding sections, and that does give me hope. Um, is there anything this way I care about? I don't think so. You just go up here. Um, so... Have you seen any of this game, or did you just hear me talking about it? Because I, I think to explain why I'm excited, I need to... I would need to give a little extra context. I've only seen me play it. Okay. You know how there's monsters that spawn in the dungeons, right? That's a thing that happens? Um... There is one item in the game. No, that's not what I want to say. Let me start with the way that works is every time you move, there's a chance that a monster will spawn next to you. That's what we're working with here. There's an item in the game that makes that chance zero for you. <coughs> so whenever you move, there's just no chance that anything will spawn next to you. It's also really easy to duplicate items in this and give them to everyone that's playing. And so I, I happened to come across this item, which was very lucky to find it all, and now everybody has it, and so I just don't need to deal with monsters anymore. Monsters aren't all bad. Uh, there are some nice things you can get from them. However, fighting in this game is really slow. I think it is, by quite a wide margin, the slowest part of any anything in this. And we just don't need to put up with that anymore. Until we go back to the story missions. We will need to deal with it again then. This is not... <laughs> this is a very uh, widely laid out dungeon. I'm not feeling great about this. So yeah, you can see if I open up my inventory, everybody has that book 
That book is called Folklore, and Folklore is what's doing that. Okay, I want you to keep going up. That said, this is still going to take a very long time. My main character winner is uh, level 8 right now, and I need to get him to level 15. You really died again? <laughs> God. The folklore puts the monsters to sleep, that's right, that's right. I don't think I need you to do anything. You're gonna come back up, and you, I wanna get that flag. So yeah, the hope at this point is I just do this for a while, and I'll get more money, and I'll level up. I think occasionally I might do some story missions to break up the grinding, because story missions should get me more money per mission than what I'm doing now. They just take a lot longer. Um, but I need to do them eventually anyway, so it, I don't know, it makes sense to me to do them sometimes. Where, you're gonna go right in there, you can get these flags, that's what you can do. Yeah, I, I'm not really sure what optimizing this game is gonna end up looking like. This is a weird one, this is a really weird one. Because it's four players of level growth. I only need to get one of them to a high level, but it benefits me if they're all higher levels. I'm not sure if I even need to be doing this. Maybe it is faster to be playing against the AI in the end? I don't know. I... I don't know. This is the target item? It is. And I do actually really want to get you up to winner, because you do have a really good item. Like a, a valuable item, one I, I want to sell. Oh, although... Gosh, no, a few of you do. Uh-oh, wait a minute. Okay, I guess I'll try to get a few things to, uh, to Winner. Winner picked up all the cheap stuff by accident. unfortunate, <laughs> but it's neat. It's not what I wanted to happen at all. Uh, where... gosh, what even is the best path for you? Is it to go through here and hit that trap? Probably. Right, and then you're doing that. Okay, you, uh... yeah, just take the hits, I guess. Uh, it's neat that A managed to do serious damage to Winner and make it so I'm not in control. Because <laughs> now he's gonna run off and try to win. That's fine. It's fine. Uh, player B, you don't need to be doing anything. You, I do want going through here. Dodge the trap. Okay, surrender, give up the target item, obviously. Where does it warp you? Close, it warps you close. Oh, that's perfect.
Okay, and then I want you to surrender again. Give up your garnet. Replace the dress, I guess? I think the dress is worth less than the black data disc. I don't know that for sure. It's fine that you're way off there. I, I don't need you anymore. I never needed you. I do still need you to move. Though. Would have liked it if you could move one more, but oh well. Give up that. Replace that. Now we're good. Now we're good for player player winner to finish. Okay. Sell all the extra stuff. Excellent. Excellent. Let's go ahead and just save everybody again for safety. I'm gonna do just a few story missions. Just, uh, you know, get some, some more money in the bank. spawn next to anything, did I? There we go. <clears throat> Although they all spawn next to each other, so if the item isn't one of those, I might have kind of free reign over the rest of the map, maybe? Not really, this is a gross map. A lot of the maps in this are kind of gross, actually. <laughs> I, I don't think there's any map where when I load in, I'll be like, oh yeah, this one. <clears throat> A lot of damage. Always happy to see my opponents get hurt.
Gosh, you know, the more I think about it, the more I'm feeling pretty sure I should sell the gun. I, I'm not thinking it's worth having it in the inventory slot that it is. I'm just not going to be fighting that much, and when I am fighting, that one damage difference won't matter anymore. It mattered a lot for missions 3 and 6 when I really am trying to get every advantage I can get, but I don't think it matters at this point. <clears throat> This way? No, that was the only one up here. It's down and this way. giving up some damage, it's true. <laughs> Maybe that decision will come back to haunt me in the future, but, uh, but I feel okay about it at the moment. attacking me, really? Why? Uh-oh. That's okay. That's less okay. That's too far away. That's too far away from everything. I don't think I could win at that point. spawn for me in particular, isn't it? Oh, uh, it depends on what kind of AI. I think that might be model pass. We'll see. Might be Heldane, actually. No, it's model. You are going for those. And you got it immediately, and you have seven defense, and I'm not fighting you. <laughs> Trying to figure out good button mashing techniques. But uh these buttons are so small. I can't I can't easily get two fingers to, to hit it. Ooh, I'm spawned next to an item now. Do I get the lucky item spawn this time? Maybe, though. There's another one I'm pretty close to. I 
It's such a good controller. I love... I loved these. This is my favorite controller of all time. I'm so happy that I can play N++ with this controller. I'm not wrong, there is another item up there, right? I thought it was closer than that, but I didn't see it there. Oh, by the way, Jacobo, did I tell you what other game I picked up recently? It was, like, within the last week it would have been. Do not remember if I had mentioned it. Don't think so. Well, the AIs play. Happened to find this at my game store. Cannot get an angle on it. There we go. I was very happy. I, uh, I've been looking for that one for a while. I have no idea where I should go. <laughs> I, uh... I'm not close to any of the other items. They all are. I, I might have to reset this one again. I could take Mwadib in a fight, probably. Yinin, less so. Tylissa, maybe. Same, Lucas. I do as well. Is that the only item left? I... Oh... I'm not. I'm resetting again. It wasn't super high on my radar until I saw a bunch of speedruns of it. It's a pretty sick game. I was sure I would like it anyway, just, you know, given other people I knew who really enjoyed it, but now I've seen a bunch of it and I did really want it. But yeah, my uh, my stores just haven't had it till now. <clears throat> it does. It it really does. Book. Thank you, thank you. Well, that was the only item I saw that was close to me. Where should I be going now? You're gonna get that one. I don't think there was anything else down here. <clears throat> yeah, I guess I should just go north. Get out of here, Tamil. What are you doing? Why? I didn't do anything to you. Get out of here. What kind of roll was that? Oh my god. Outrageous. I have a plus four on him and he still beat me on movement. Still not the target item. 
I still have a chance. My nose is irritated. I might need to sneeze soon. I also need to use the bathroom. I've kind of needed to do that for a while. I should probably do that after my turn. Since it's unlikely anything will come at me during my turn. So yeah, after I, uh, after I move next, I'll get up and use the bathroom. Let's go. Cool. I'll be right back. Okay, now I need to get to the exit, which is not ideal because a bunch of stuff is in my way. I think I should go around there. Where was this person? Not particularly close to me. Let's go around, because Tamil is probably just going to one-shot me. Tamil is confused, but even so. It may be time loss in the moment, but it's really one of those you gotta lose time to save time things. How does the place look after being vacuumed? I didn't... I didn't check. Joe vacuumed the downstairs, which is not where I was. Also, Jacobo, you don't learn Fire 2 yet, uh, but you are three levels away from evolving into Jokomelian. So there's that to look forward to. Is there a trap I left around here? I think I passed it already. I would have passed it.
I should have used a uh, an evasion card. It's silly of me to not be using those. That's just risk for no reason. The only thing that can stop me at this point is hitting a damage trap. <laughs> Also, I think it's next mission is the special one. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it's the mission where we're introduced to uh, the best name. Okay, save. Wait, hold on. Sell, and then save. That one. Now save. Okay. You still don't have a ton of money, but that's fine. You're gonna do another mission, you're gonna... You're gonna get more. Is it the next one? I think it's the next one. Yeah, no, it's mission... It's mission 9, this is mission 8. By the way, I think we are through... Half the missions in the game? This will be half. I think this will be the halfway point. Um, I guess I'll go after these three items. Not to imply that this run is going to be more than nine hours long, but in terms of number of missions, halfway. this much movement. I love rolling a 1 and moving further than someone else can go on their turn if they roll a 6. It's so nice. items. I also... yeah, I don't want to fight anybody. If somebody else picks up the item, I'm resetting. None of these fights would go well for me. new. I don't think I've ever seen that one. I, I don't remember picking up a small blue thing like that. I've seen larger blue things. Crud. Oh, which one is that? No, he's got too much health. I can't take him. Too much health, too much defense. It's actually a really well-rounded character. <laughs> I 
I know it's way too late to ask Joe to implement something like this, but it would be kind of cool if along with a level you got stats. <laughs> That would be so much more to implement than just the experience, though. attacking these guys. The first one wouldn't be too bad, especially with his lower health now. The other two have quite a bit of health. Yeah, it's still not ideal. I think I should walk into the exit right now and hope it warps me somewhere good. That's, uh, that's my best bet. That's somewhere good. My goodness. I'll take that, sure. gonna try to attack me, but I'll be able to outrun him pretty quickly when he does. I can also leave a stun trap here, which will help even more. Well, it's a good thing I left that stun trap there. <laughs> he's gonna dodge it though, isn't he? No, he's not! Let's go. Okay. If this guy gets it, I lose, though. <laughs> Dang it. It was a good try. It was a good effort. Closely packed items that I am not close to. <laughs> At least I have this plus three movement. <clears throat> that helps a little bit.
Okay. I am getting closer to the big, the big item group. We'll see if I can get much out of that. Looks like I'm going to be fighting with one guy over them. So I may need to think a little bit carefully about how I maneuver around to push them away. Okay, Gull. Probably gonna get that one by the exit. I don't know where you're going. <laughs> For them to a gold. That's kind of funny. That that does sound like some good GTA humor. <laughs> of these still. Okay, go this way. Try to get in this guy's way of those items. <clears throat> what is the beer name? His Vasa. <laughs> yeah. That is a good one. Where are you going, dude? You are going for that, okay. So I should have a chance to get this group of like five items here. Potentially all of them. We'll see, we'll see how our movement rolls go. Not that one. Is it this one? That's the other big question. Is he about to get it? He's not. Okay. Okay, I have a really good chance of winning here. I shouldn't say really good. I don't actually know what the movement stat was on uh, on the guy I'm going to be competing with, but I've got a chance. <laughs> Two. That's not great. It's not nothing, though. Um... Okay, I'll see what my movement is on, uh, on this next turn to decide where I should go. Which will increase my odds more. Until fall, will they full develop it? Interesting. Interesting choice to shut it down for that time. <sighs> oh, thank goodness. Okay. I'm very curious where the other guy's gonna go exactly. My next move depends a lot on what he rolls. Low roll, low roll, come on, come on. Four is not low. I think I should go back for that item I was next to. <clears throat> go back and take it, and I can probably outpace him to the bottom too as well. Okay, okay. I am in a little bit of danger, depending on uh, where he moves to. Okay, he's fighting a monster. That helps me a little. The other guy is also about to come out, though. I basically, I think I have a 50-50 shot of getting the item. There are two left, and it is just as likely that I just won't get it. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. <clears throat> I 
Really wish I could have gotten it there, but oh well. Um, I worry that my character's gonna move in a dumb way there, so I think I should move here instead. Because there would have been a stun trap that I would have walked across otherwise. Low roll? Not low enough. Ooh, I might get it. <clears throat> we might get it. We might get it here. Have fun, golf. Let's just do some evasion. Oh, and I evaded the damage trap. Oh my god. Terrifying. <clears throat> I'm about to get attacked. I should be able to just deal with it. I, I'm at full health. I got a movement card left, right? No, I don't. I used it already. It's okay. Yeah, you are gonna attack me. You only have five attack. I can strike back and protect myself pretty well. Very good. You're moving, really? <laughs> Uh, the monster's gonna go after me, but I don't think it's gonna reach me. It's way too far away. This is not ideal. Uh, where do I want to go? I guess here? The monster's gonna attack me either way. So I might as well move to a place where it's not in my way. Oh, right, it's asking me to fight. I thought it was giving me a second turn for a second. I was very confused. But no, this makes sense. You're gonna get up. The monster's gonna try to fight me. I should be able to outrun it. Unless I roll really badly, I should be able to outrun it. It's also weak, so it doesn't matter if it hits me. Which it doesn't anyway. And then it's my turn. I've already walked along here. I'm not worried about traps right there. You're gonna attack me, aren't you? You're not, really. Interesting. Okay. That is fine. Fine by me. Okay, and then one or two more turns and I should be able to win. Why are you attacking me now? What are you doing? You weird, weird person. I think that's a slime and that slime's probably gonna attack me too. But that's also fine.
classic. Also, honestly, pretty classic. <laughs> the game, the game did a funny there. Oh. Gotta love when that happens. Okay, I am again just going to run. I should outpace you, just fine, yeah. You're gonna attack the other guy, and I can go to the exit next turn. <clears throat> now we go. There we go. Okay, mission eight done. Oof. I have enough money to level up, but um, we can do one more mission. We can hear about roast beef here. I'm gonna get some water. My throat's really dry. Everybody say hi to roast beef. Beef percent complete. <clears throat> Very nice golf. Very good one. I don't have anything particularly close by, but I also have four movements, so who cares? lucky to run into the item here. All the items seem pretty spread out on this one. He's probably gonna go south. Yeah. There were two over here? There are three over there. That's where I should go. get some bad rolls going back to uh, the exit. He might run into a monster going back to the exit. We'll see.
It's unlikely, but a non-zero chance that I can still win. What I voted for for the MMR, my first vote was Jersey Devil, then Kingsley, then Rugrats, then Monsters, Inc., I think. Uh, the MMR is the Misfit Mascot Relay, the relay that I did Bugs Life for. They're preparing for another one. They had a, a voting system set up to try to gauge what people would be interested in running. And yeah, that is still a good start goal. Very good. Oh, and I need to sneeze. <coughs> oh. Horrible. There were some others that I thought about picking that I thought, like, if this gets in, I would learn it. Like, Tomba? would be cool, but, um, I don't know, if it's gonna be in March, that's not a ton of time to learn a new game. Especially one that I, I haven't even played. I mean, Monsters, Inc. Scream Team, I would need to learn. I've played it before, I did a blind run of it, but, uh, I would need to actually spend time learning it. <clears throat> It'd be cool if Rugrats got in. That's much like Bugs Life. That is a game that I did some a little bit of years ago and would be nice to have an excuse to actually get better at. <laughs> hoping I'd have one more turn. Uh, I guess set a leg trap real quick. God, I'm not getting, like, anywhere. These movement rolls are pretty bad. <clears throat> Since Cyrillic. Classic. Good old GeoGuessr. Yeah, 3598 on a round like that. Not bad. Okay, so if I use this, and I run up next to him, and attack him... What's he gonna do? He's not even gonna defend, really? I mean, I'm not gonna kill him or anything this turn, but... I'm a little surprised by that. Okay, he's gonna fight back. He's probably gonna attack me on his turn as well. And he's probably gonna do a decent amount of damage. But on my next turn... I'm gonna place the damage trap and move. He's gonna try to walk into me. No, he's not. He's gonna try to path to the exit. I need to move pretty far, actually. <clears throat> You're not gonna attack me, really? Not even gonna try. Oh, that actually really worries me. Wait a minute. I don't have. That's... Uh-oh. Okay. Okay. 
I need to change my plan slightly, but I can still make this work. The important thing is that he walks into a damage trap. And then I start walking over this way, I block his path here, and he's gonna go back the other way to the exit. Good, okay. Or he'll just start going, that works too. And I kind of need to hope that enemy stays out of the way. Yeah. Yeah. We'll see what happens. We'll see. Unfortunate. So unfortunate. I had a plan. I was executing on the plan. Was not enough. Sometimes... Sometimes that's just not enough. Good old Battle Hunter. Roast beef, round two. Okay, I'm starting next to a couple items. I might have a good shot at a couple more, depending on how these go. Doesn't help. Do I play any good mobile games? No. I play Words with Friends. Uh, there was a, a Civ-like game called Polytopia that I liked, but I just I didn't stick with it. I'm just not in the mood to play games like that anymore. The nice thing about Polytopia, though, is it's very bite-sized. It's a game that scratches the Civ itch, but also you can do a full round of it in, like, half an hour. I think half an hour would be, like, a long round for it. Um, there's a puzzle game that I've been enjoying called Hair 136. I've been playing that for more than a year, I've really stuck with it. Uh, just because they have daily puzzles in it. <clears throat> um, it's just like a... It's not an ice game, but it's like an ice sliding puzzle game. <laughs> you know, the ones that end up in video games where it's like... You can move a thing, but it'll keep going until it hits a wall. It's that kind of puzzle game. And it's cute, and it's fun, and the daily puzzles are fun. And I found it because my friend Jake has a few friends in Chile, I think, who developed it. I think it's Chile. Oh, golf, no. What happened? But yeah, other than that, I, I don't do mobile games much. I never really have.
It would help if I would stop rolling, like, once. Wait a minute. My attack went up. Why does the game think I... I never identified that gun. Why does the game think I did? What is going on with that? That's not the first thing that the game incorrectly assumed I identified. What did I do that broke identification? Is this the secret hundo strat? And why do I keep rolling ones? That's funny, Golf. You got it, though. Considering the bad rounds, that's not a bad score. Six. Good enough. Junk. <clears throat> and you're gonna fight me. And I am a little worried about that, actually. It's not good. But I could run away. I can always run away. I wonder, if I were to check the inventory... Come on. It's the item that's way out there. Uh, I wonder if the game would think that I have identified everything I've picked up at this point. Because for 100%, that's super broken. Don't fight me! What are you doing? Stop it! <laughs> and he spawned behind him. Great. Where's my squirt bottle item for the AI? I don't know. I should, I should really find one of those. Okay. What's the path to that? And is it just that one? I think it is. I think that is the last item left. I am also mildly worried about another damage trap. I should I should heal once before moving again. Because if I hit a damage trap again, it's gonna kill me. Very good movement. Unfortunately, one of the agents already has an E card, so I can't... I can't just hope that I'll get that one. I can. There is another one in the deck, but I'm not going to get that one at least. Okay. 
there we go. Throw out that junk. Uh, getting out of here is gonna be a little tricky. There are a few guys who are closing in on me and not a lot of... Oh yeah, that guy's gonna warp. Where's he gonna go? I hate this game! <sighs> okay. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna stand here, and he needs to get out of the way. He won't be able to block me. He'll step in the way. He got the other E card? Dude. Okay, whatever. We're leaving. this guy. He will block my path if I stand there. He cannot block my path if I stand there. He could block my path if I go that way. Any path I take could be blocked. That's, that's what I'm getting from this. I could surrender an item. I think that's the better option. I'm gonna go here. I don't know what this guy's doing. He might roll a one. Or he'll do that. Okay. I can surrender an item. Because that's not worth very much. Good enough. Okay, I don't... Uh, I didn't go all the way around here. I don't know if there are any traps. I'm also full on attack cards, so I won't be able to get any movement cards regardless. Or evasion cards, for that matter. This guy's moving really fast. I'm a little concerned about that, but I think I'll be okay. Yeah, I should be fine. He's not even going to me. It's weird. good enough, but that's fine. There is extremely little chance for me to lose. I could still lose, but there is extremely little chance for me to lose. That guy moving is actually one of the worst things that could have happened. Uh-oh. Am I gonna lose? Probably not. Just roll low. We're fine. Okay, we're fine. Okay, there we go. Roast beef mission, done. We're through mission 9 of 15. Sell the extra stuff.
Am I right that this gun is worth a thousand? No, that's a really good gun. That, for plus three attack, that is actually worth hanging on to. Okay, now real quick, what is going on here? None of this is identified, but... You're telling me this is all of a sudden? Why? That's so strange. That's so strange. Uh, let's level up because I think we can. Yeah, we're fine. Save again because I should have leveled up before saving. Mission 10. Roast Beef Part 2. Those two guys are gonna fight over those. This guy doesn't seem particularly close to anything. He's probably gonna go for the one up top. Good, good use of a turn. There was a way. No. A uh, way to read the RNG. I mean, not like literally read it, but you know, tells about the map to figure out where the items would be. Because surely there must be so many permutations. No, I don't know. It depends on how they set this up, I guess. It might be impossible to tell, but, you know, it'd just be neat if there was something like, oh, you can see, you know, this box is over on this corner of this specific map, and these guys spawned with these stats, so this one will be the target item. Would be nice. Would be nice to have something like that. A 
amazing. 14 damage, ooh. That's a tough one. of that guy to not go for the items he was next to. of crates around there. Should probably be going to those guys next. they will just be concerned with the enemies they're next to and they won't go for the items. But we'll see. There's also one down there. Okay. <clears throat> you are probably gonna sweep before... You both are, before I could get there. You got it anyway. Um, I could fight that guy. I might be able to get it from him. Especially with enemies also attacking him. Weak enemies, but still. They could do something. Four damage, that's, that's something. That's something. feeling 5.5 hours in? Uh, like, I wish that I wasn't an hour and a half behind after mission 6. I should heal, actually. It is unlikely that I'd be able to one-shot this guy. Um, I'm happy I had a big lunch because I'm not very hungry right now. Um, I'm a little bummed because there is some chicken in the fridge that I really wanted to use tonight. So, we'll see what time it is when I finish. I may have to just throw out a chicken breast though. this guy. Oh, I can't reach him. We will see what the monster... No, never mind. I just can't reach him. How close is he to the end? I, I can't win. There's no reason to finish that.
What's the longest single game run I've done? DK64. It was part of a multi-game run, but DK64 alone took me 15 hours. Second longest would be Galaxy 2, which took me, I want to say like 13, 12 or 13. Um, and then Galaxy 1, of course, took like 7 when I got decent at it. My first 117 took me seven and a half hours. I think those are the only really long single game runs I've done. I have no idea where I should go. There aren't any good options. I am far from everything. I will start by going up, because everyone else is pretty far from the bottom as well. Was there another long single game thing I did? I'm not sure. I mean, my first Crash 3 runs also took a little while, but still, like, well under five hours. N++, of course, yes. Yeah, my first Triumphant run was like 12 hours, 12 and a half hours. I still think it'd be cool to submit that to really, really long a thon at some point. Uh, yeah, I'll go for the one up top. And then head down to the bottom of the map. My way? What the heck? I'm I'm going there, man. Yeah, I mean, I can try to hit him. Yeah. The problem with this guy is if I hit him, I should be doing a lot of damage. But that's if I hit him. And he's gonna be running all the time. And he has a better than 50% chance of just running every, every attempt. Yeah, it's wild. I noticed recently that everything in top 100 is sub 140. And I think that's pretty crazy. setting. Not gonna waste my time with that. Thank you. 
I would not be able to reach that. Well, I don't know. Maybe it'll go the other way. Who knows what these AI do. Sometimes they make weird choices. No. Okay. <sighs> Dude. <coughs> Maybe I could take him. It's worth a try. from the monster, I could probably get away with the damage trap thing. We'll see. We'll see. Um, it's got some big evasion cards, though, so let's just move there. is gonna move. He only moved one space? Interesting choice. I wonder if my presence here is stopping him from moving further. For some reason. Yeah, just stand still. See what he does. A space over. There, maybe. <laughs> Again, just see what he does. Good. That's not what I wanted. That's not the worst, though. I can work with that. Because he needs to spend a turn getting up. I have really high attack right now, along with two strong cards. Dang well. And I'm gonna roll like garbage. <laughs> okay. Is frustrating goal. Oh crap, it's my turn already. garbage person. So far away.
He only has 13 health, though. If I can just get a good attack on him, I could be able... I could take him. Just need to hit him. Pretty good movement, but not quite good enough. Yeah, I gotta move like up there or something, just... Yeah, just push him away. Make him take longer to walk around. Theoretically, I could one-shot him at 17 health, but I don't... I think I've only done that much damage, like, once, ever. Why are you attacking me, dude? <laughs> I just run. I don't need to deal with you. Really wish the slime had gone up and attacked him first. A lot of damage, not 17, though. Very short of 1 of 17. <sighs> um, wait, hold on a second. I need to pay attention to this battle. Oh, please don't die, dude. Okay, okay. Doing memory address stuff for SNES games, would that be considered searching hex address and similar, or is that its own thing? Yes. That- that is... that is basically the same thing. Dude! No! Stop doing that! Uh, yeah, if I said that I was going to do some, like, memory searching, memory hacking for a game, something like that, I would be looking at the hex addresses in the memory. That, that is what I would be talking about. You know what? I need to do... Uh, Duolingo today to stay up with my daily streak. And these turns take a very long time, so I'm just gonna... just gonna pull up a one practice session. Just to, uh, just to keep that up. Well, I think my turn's coming up again. Real soon. Oh, right, I'm being attacked. Sure, leave. Everyone can criticize my German. Sie ist ein Brötchen mit Käse. Where are you? Let me up there somewhere. Ich esse nicht gern Joghurt. Wir gehen einmal pro Woche surfen. That was a bread, bread golf, you're right. Dude, stop attacking me, I don't have the item! Trinks du eine Tasse Tee zum Mittagessen? Mittagessen, that's Mittagessen. It's a word I struggle to say for some reason, Mittagessen. 
swear to God, dude, stop it. Oh my God. <laughs> Meine Partnerin trifft ihr Kollegin am Wochenende. Triffst du deinen Chef jeden Mittwoch? Max ist nie Müsli zum Frühstück. Ich treffe meine Freunde jede Woche. Er trifft seine Freunde am Donnerstag im Café. Yeah, German has, as a native English speaker, German has some very silly words. I do, I do enjoy quite a few of those. Wie oft triffst du deine Eltern? Right, right. I'm not sure I'll be able to catch the guy now. He's really close to the exit. He'd need to roll a one or hit a trap or something. And it would help if I wasn't rolling a two. Okay, does he win? Even gonna attack him, and he got the exit card anyway. Ugh. So frustrating. Such a waste of time. The one that really got me. Um, it's a much simpler word, but just that the word for dark is dunkel. Oh no. Oh nine, the lampa is dunkel. It's just it's so silly. It sounds like silly English. That's wild, Lucas. It's strange because it doesn't feel like the Spyro community has grown that much, at least in 120, but it really, really has. It's easy to, uh, to miss that, I think. It just seems like more people are sticking with it longer and getting better times than they used to. I am not near anything good. If this isn't the item, I should just... Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter what I should just... right back where we came. <laughs> that was a funny one. I was bound to get a mission like this eventually. <laughs> it has to happen eventually. Save. And then we need to do some more grinding. So, load in characters. <laughs> 
I wonder... I wonder if it would be worth just letting... Um... Letting your main character run rampant through areas. Don't... No, because you need to level up the other characters. So that you can get better loot. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. item first, make sure that's not the target. Okay. I'll get that item eventually, make sure it's not the target. There's the target. Okay, now I don't need to worry about it. That's something fun that uh, ShempMD has done with a lot of the PBs he's gotten, is not only compared, you know, what place he has moved on the leaderboard, but like, the percentage up the leaderboard that he's moved. Up or down. It's very possible he's moved down in that time. Oh, that could be a valuable item though. I gotta check it. There's nothing next to you, just go to the exit. Okay. Is there anything over here? There's an item over here, yeah. There's also a trap there that I can't avoid, which is unfortunate. I'm glad I went for that. That is a valuable item. I did not mean to place a trap there. <laughs> Oops. be doing, like, anything down there. Crud. Yes, A does have things that I want to give over to Winner. The sword is less important, but, uh... the other items, definitely. Or the other item. It's just like a piece of silver. It's worth a lot. So winner gets that. Winner's gonna get the, uh, the final item, the target item. Uh, you don't need to do anything else. You can just sell that other thing you got. You're... You have the target item. You need to be getting down there, actually. I didn't mean to do that. Oops. Also, A, B, and C would be funny names. Uh, 
Uh, you actually just don't need to be doing anything, though. actually fine that you took damage. You're about to teleport anyway. Oh. What? Oh, Winter took damage. I didn't even notice. Oh my god. I don't know how I missed that. It's probably because I wasn't looking at the game. That would be my guess. Well, in that case, you can walk a little closer, and then you can walk a little closer. Or barely closer. <laughs> Emphasis on a little closer. That's fine. It'll be a bit before we get to you anyway. Just go there. Give up that. That's not the target item. Why did I want you to do that? Was there a reason for that, or am I just... There was no reason for that. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, in that case, everybody stand still, and winner, try to get to the, the other guy. Actually, is your inventory full? It's not yet. Okay, cool. Take the target item, the actual target item. And hopefully it won't take too many turns to get to the end. <laughs> to level up all of you. 23.5, you can't. 6,000. You and AC both can. There we go. What level am I trying to get winner to? I guess like 13. 
would be really nice. I'm not... I'm not sure. I don't have the most concrete plan right now. Ooh, Ooh that's a good item. to just hand that off to Winner. Get this flag now so someone else might be able to... Nope, never mind. Problem Gulf is you do get money from the story missions. So I think it might be better to stop at like level 13 and then just go back to story missions. Rather than waste time doing extra these missions that I otherwise don't really need to. Uh, do you have anything worthwhile? No. I think you can stop moving, AC. Oh, the flag is there. Never mind, I should go for the flag. Is there an item up here also? There is. Oh, yeah, that's worth going for. <clears throat> and I definitely want to get the garnet to, uh, to winner, so you go up. How do the flags work? They give you points. Um, I want to say they give you 250 points by default. And, uh... Yeah, I guess I want to pass it from you, and that's all I really need to do. Winner's inventory is already pretty full. Uh, I want to say they give you 250 points by default. But when you pick up one... Uh, it rolls a die, of course, and has a random effect. The yellow flag in particular, all of the random effects will give you bonus points. Um, up to, at rolling a six, you get times eight points, so 2,000 points for one flag. Which, I still never did the math for how much money that's actually getting you. The red flags can heal you, if you roll a 1 on any of the flags, you get a trap related to it. Uh, you go this way. And then, yeah, money translates to... or points translates to money, of course. You can stay again. <clears throat> Is it worth trying to go down? Yeah, sure. Meet that way. So right now... Every 15 points is worth something like 9 money. I, I don't know what dungeon level this is at the moment. I'm guessing it's level 8 or 9. That's a really good item, too. Is it time that I give up my gun? It's plus 3 attack. I shouldn't give it up.
Yeah. I'll just let AC get... Or I guess it's B, get a bunch of extra points, because... My inventory's basically full. So yeah, in this round, um, B got 3,000 points from flags, which translates to, it looks like this would have been level 6? What level are they? Is this 6 or 7? Seven? 7. That was level 7. So 3,000 divided by 15 is 200 times 7. So B got 1,400 coins for those flags? If I did the math right. Which, no promises. For some reason I've been struggling to do that in my head this whole time. Another folklore. Astounding. I did not think it was a very common item. It was a while before I found any in uh, my casual playthrough. What is down here? Oh, that's such a gross place to try to get to. Okay. Yeah, you can go that way. So what did... Oh, right, it was folklore. And you got leg trapped. <laughs> Honestly, maybe I should be having A go up and... force Winter to surrender one of those books just to fix their leg. That would probably be a better use of their time. God, everybody hit a different trap. We hit all four traps, we did it! Oh, actually, they can just go to the exit. It doesn't matter. Brilliant. Very cool. Perhaps we did it, Admiral Akbar. The classic line.
god. <laughs> There's so many traps here. Are there so many traps here, or am I just hitting all of them? <laughs> Oh, that's not actually where I meant to go. Oh well. Okay, let's walk you into the exit just so you can move again. That's fine. Lucas! The Lucas. The stun trap. Yeah, let's just walk you over. worth handing over. Only B. I think I want to go up that way, so... <sighs> A's item is okay, but... I don't think it's worth the inventory slot. My inventory is full, but we will see what's in those boxes. Actually, maybe it is worth having, uh, having B pick up one of those. Just so items aren't going to waste. A and AC, though, they're way too far away. They wouldn't be able to catch them. That's worth getting. Just wait there for a minute while B picks up this item. What is it? Nothing good. Okay. Although there is a yellow flag there. So A, real quick, go pick up that yellow flag also. How many points? Decent amount of points. This would have been level 8 now, if they're all level 6. Okay. Oh, 
Not the most profitable dungeon, but not too bad. Actually, no, it was pretty bad. <laughs> now that I'm looking at it, that was a lot of junk. Um, no one can level up yet. It's 8,500 for uh, for level seven. Ridiculous. <laughs> oh, come on. Crutch. I did not need to use that movement card. Ooh, that looks valuable. I want that. Disc, leg trap. Yellow flag is up there. I do want you going for the yellow flag. The yellow flag is the nice one to have bouncing around. Is it worth sticking around in a level and just picking up the yellow flag a bunch of times? If this is level 8, um, and flags are 250 points minimum. I don't know what 250 divided by 15 is. Can someone help me on the math on that? <laughs> Fifty divided by 15, it's more than 10 less than 20. It's like 17 or something? About? It's not going to be perfect, but something around there. has a bunch of really good items, so I think we're good to just leave. Let's say it was 15. 15 points per flag minimum. Or 15 coins per flag minimum. Times 8. That's like 200 coins per flag? That's not bad. That's 
really not bad. Five flags gets you a thousand coins. And then that's not even counting the, the bonuses you might roll on the yellow flag. Oh, the green flag's right there. They should be getting that, too. Or maybe I should just leave that for winter also. Did I leave a trap in here? No. Good. Oh, well, they have the yellow flag now. I should get that. Flag farming is the strat. God, I, I wish I had any idea what the math on this would look like. a lot of the things that would normally deter you from just jumping on the flags forever aren't here. We don't run into monsters. We can avoid gone forever if we want to. We don't have to use cards. So yeah, if we wanted, we could potentially just do that. Like this, it's 200 coins for me to just go over to this flag. Minimum. That has to be worth it. There's no way it's not. If I'm doing the math right, which again, I don't know that I am. One of the guides I read said that it's a maximum of 50,000 points per category, I think. So it's not like we can do it actually forever. But you can farm a lot of flags. How many flag points did I get? 4,500... divided by 15 is... 300 times 8? That's like 2,400 coins just from flags? Ooh, that is worth a lot. Let's go. They're cursed objects, and I don't remember what they do. As I recall, the, the trick with them is when somebody fights you, you surrender and give it to them. And then they're stuck with whatever the really bad consequence of that is. Yeah, and it's worth a lot of money. <laughs> that's that's the nice thing about it. I didn't know what it looked like, but it's it's nice to have found it. I can level up again, for sure. Uh, B can also level up. Five movement! Oh, that's beautiful.
Red book. There's a chance the dungeon level's higher now, but I don't know. Don't know for sure. <sighs> Winner should walk into the exit from here. One of the other players is really close to the items. You could get someone more helpful. Uh, no, you can go for that one. You should go for these. That's a good one. Uh, what's over here? Nothing. One item. Another item. A lot of items over there, actually. Flags are super far out of the way. Okay, you should go up. That's my call for you. Winner can start heading down to get the items there, as well as the red flag. A, you can get this other item and also start picking up these flags. Should you also go to the exit? No. Now follow A down south. Good item. That's worth a lot. You should head out in case flags show up, but other than that, I don't need you doing anything. You should go up and get the red flag. Look at this movement range! <laughs> Absolutely insane. All stopped by a single trap. Classic. There's the target item. That's good, that's good. You... can chill out. You can chill out. Someone else is going to walk over and get that flag soon anyway. Oh, you got healed. Wait a minute. I didn't realize that guy's leg was healed. He had more movement than that.
26 F. Oof. Oh my god. The yeah, that sounds not fun. it was A and B have things to give over. They do. B has two things to give over also, so I should really focus on B first. We'll see how it is. That's perfect. Yeah, collect all those little flags. That's less perfect, but that's okay. traps. Already took your item, so I don't need to fight you again. So many traps! Uh, right? Yeah. Yeah, you can wander off. Pick up any flags that show up that way. You are set on all these flags now. <laughs> well, they all ended up over here. Neat. No, I want main character to pick up that flag on the way back. I think I'm gonna go ahead and call this mission complete soon. Just gonna snag a few more flags. Call it good. How can I pass these up? Honestly, they're right there for me.
Okay, and no, nope, I'm going right back for that. I was gonna say now I'm going for the exit, but... Again, it's right there. I can't pass that up. Now I'm going for the exit. There aren't any other flags close enough to be worth it. We're moving on. Okay, this flag is close enough to be worth it. The two extra turns it takes, sure. Although it would be really funny if it causes a third extra turn by breaking my leg. Oh! No, it causes zero extra turns. Very nice. Another one! Oof. I've been watching Dact doing all that Final Fantasy IX speedrunning recently, and I guess some part of me just really thought, like, yeah, I want to do a long, boring version of this. <laughs> it's like this, except it's super repetitive, and you feel like you're not making any progress for a long time. I'm just, I'm so sure that this could be optimized by so much, though. It could be an interesting run. We just need to figure some things out about it. Gotta do the math to figure out what is actually the best strategy, instead of just guessing at it and changing my guess every few hours. So you want to get all the flags, that's where you're going. And you're probably going to go up north. Wait, did I already get the yellow flag? I must have. Unless it's behind my head right now, it's not. Okay. It was worth a glance. No, there's the flag. Player one's up here, it's not exactly worth you doing anything. There we go. There is... There are no more items here. We already got them all. Okay. <clears throat> that suddenly makes these flags less worth getting. But 
we can see. That helps, actually. flag ended up next to me. Less perfect, but we can manage. Good enough. Traps the exit? I don't know. This game loves doing that. There we go. Why isn't there a Dizando Tauserter 2? In before, Horns gifts a sub to the until now secret account. I also do not remember how much money Winner needs to level up, which kind of matters. I was thinking about it, Golf. I was ready for it. There we go. Now they can level up. Wait, what? Wait, how much do you need? 11k. Never mind. You can level up. B is almost there. How much does... 34,000. There we go. That's what I need to know. Okay. Let's do another save. Nope, not what I needed to do. <laughs> PS2s read memory cards faster than PS1s. Wouldn't that be just a hilarious piece of a uh, of speedrun knowledge? Yeah, PS2 is fastest for this game because it reads memory cards faster. <laughs> PS2s read memory cards faster, but only if you turn the music off first. Ooh, this one's worth a lot. Close to anything, winner. Gosh, you're really not. You can go to the bottom to get the one item down there. That's what you can do. About mashed potatoes and punching? No. You even get a sword or something, okay. 
No, I, I don't. That doesn't sound familiar to me. Suppose you want to eat with some friends and got some mashed potatoes. Okay. I will do my best to suppose that, but no promise. <laughs> My imaginative abilities are stretched pretty thin right now, so, you know. Hit or miss whether or not I can suppose anything at the moment. That one of my friends just buried his face right in my plate of mashed potatoes and took a big lick. God, I hate that friend. Would I kill that friend? I assume is what you're gonna ask. Oh, would it be morally permissible to punch him in the face? Ooh. That's a question that would get me in less trouble. Um... <laughs> yeah, um... Gosh, I don't know. It's one of those things where, like, I'd be mad, and I'd probably want to, but what would that help? Clearly there's something else going on with him, and that's not gonna solve anything. Split 2-2 two, two down the middle. Had strong opinions. Yeah, no, I get that. I didn't mean to use a trap. That's kind of bad. It's not that bad, I guess. Okay, what do you have? You have several things that you should hand over. I think that's a really good sword. And I want to hand over the target item, of course. Okay. Okay. Um, you should actually chill up here. Because I want Winner to get those flags. Several things that you should hand over me when I'm the most polite bank robber. Uh, you don't have anything good, so you can just stay there. Yeah, the speedrun, it did pretty quickly go from feeling like, yeah, I'm leveling up a bunch of people, we're training together, to me just really taking advantage of my crew. Okay, you go up there and get those four items, and I'll get all the flags, and <laughs> then I'll take all of the items from you. If you end up away from me, just come back to me. I'll take the items from you, it's okay. traveling circus and a kid who wants to run away and join me shows his act hoping to the spot. He crushes dreams. What if he doesn't want you to take the items? That's too bad. I'm in charge. It's too bad. Omni leveled up, hell yeah. Okay, good. 
Yeah, I should get it there too. That is a close enough yellow flag. Very nice. Oh, I should take that one too. That is also a close enough yellow flag. Okay, now I can go to the exit. Don't think there are any other flags nearby. Yeah, I can go to the exit. Want you to take the roles can just barely flit it as a Twitch username? I'm not familiar. I've heard of Boy Meets World. I don't know anything about it. But it is always nice when joke names can fit. I do. Okay. Uh, and B can also level up, and A and AC definitely can't. But we do have stuff to sell also. No, don't go back to the nurse. Didn't want to go back to the clinic. Okay. Yeah, this is a... it's a long one. It would have been faster if I didn't lose an hour and a half in the first what should have been two hours, but... Oh well. Wait, what? Oh yes, sell that. can't level up. I... Yeah, I'll do the next few story missions. Save everybody and do those. We should be getting there. I think we're getting there, though. And that's exciting. I think that's exciting. I announced that that is exciting. And everyone agrees, and everybody clapped. saved. Everyone's there. Now kick him out. We had done up through mission 9, I think? I think we did it through 10. So this is 11. This is gonna be 11, 12, 13. God, why is there such a big cluster there? I I have one way out.
one item there, and then I go to the top, I guess? I think that's, that's the route. It's the only route that makes sense to me. Thanks, Lucas. I appreciate it. I wonder if you can pretty safely assume that you'll come across folklore at some point. Golf absolutely cannot believe that you're ducking out like this. That's what it was supposed to me. <laughs> I get it, golf. My fingers are doing similar things. I don't know if you've noticed, but I think some of my menuing has gotten worse over time. <laughs> Thanks, Lucas. I can't wait to become a folklore speedrunner just as a meme because of this game. <laughs> okay, the two people I was most worried about getting that big cluster of items are now dealing with mobs, so I think I should be good. No, he didn't say that. Very cool. It's a good item, but it's not the item I need. What's he gonna stream, did he say? Art stream. Nice. I do like Mole's art. seen that one before. It's a big roll. That is a bigger roll than I wanted you to roll. Takes a car into the shop today to get the oil changed. Yeah, you had mentioned you were going to do that. Did that go well? Did they lose the, the car while it was there? It's all ship shape. That worries me a little bit. I would prefer it to be car shaped. But you're the car guy, I'll trust your, your instincts there. That's another really good roll. Dang it. Yes. Where's it gonna send him? Okay, good. I was worried that was gonna send him up to the item cluster I'm going after. Shoot. 
I'm... No, I can't deal with that. Hmm, <clears throat> I see. I guess oil and oil change could do that. That's interesting though. I should probably be doing more of this run standing up since I have been sitting for roughly seven hours. Yeah, I will stand for a little bit. Exit that's pretty far away. The toaster has popped. How do I get there? I'm not really seeing a great path there. Are you going after me? No. Is anybody going after me? Am I gonna get a free ride? Did I get lucky AI? Okay, I go down, 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 over? That's slow. There's no way. No, I go that way. Although the nice thing about down is it's out of the way of everybody, so I think I should do that actually. <laughs> And now you're going after me, now that my limb is broken. He doesn't seem to be chasing me anymore. We might be okay. We'll see. We'll see how it is. We'll see what happens. Why are you 
running there, guy? I don't appreciate that. You also, where are you going? Okay, yeah, you better turn around. This is what I thought. If somebody attacks me, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna surrender. Ah, oh, that's a jewel though, I want that. We'll see what happens. Who is this? I don't... It's no one I want to fight. This is the only person I'd be comfortable fighting, and it's not them. You stay back, dude. You stay away from me. I hate you. You suck. Okay, that's not that far back. And I got my legs back, so I should be okay. That's a lie. I could hit another leg trap at any time. I would pray for the escape card, except my hand is full of attack cards, so I can't even draw new cards. Did I leave a trap here? God, I think I did! But I don't remember where. It was just a stunt trap. I don't think I left any leg traps there. I just left a trap, though. And that monster's gonna block off that path. And that guy's blocking off that path anyway. And I have nothing else to sacrifice. <sighs> um... I'm in a bad spot, but there's not a lot I can do about it. You're gonna try to fight me, but I can pretty easily run away. Probably. Yeah. I'm gonna run past you and I'm gonna get stunned, and that's gonna suck. But I, I don't have a lot of choices. Oh, it's the next turn. It's the next turn I'll hit the stun trap. safe from them for a turn. Are you really gonna go attack me again? No, you are running off. Okay. You're gonna... You're standing on the stun trap. I can't deal with that. Dude. I... I... I'll try to fight it. Maybe I can do some damage. I could run from this too. I could run around away from them. I don't know, man. These things have a lot of health, unfortunately. But if this kills me, I'm okay. I mean, not okay, okay. It's It puts me in a pretty bad spot, but I'm not ruined. We, uh, we'll just have to see what happens.
And now we also get to see how much those uh, those little blue jewels are that I've been seeing around. How much those are worth. Oof. I gave it away. I forgot that I gave it away. Never mind, I will never find out how much that is worth. I don't know if that's a really valuable thing or a not valuable thing. Okay, next round. I believe that was 10. This should be 11. It says relics level 13, but that's just because that's my level. I think this is mission 11. Or 12? God, I don't remember. I have no idea. I'll be able to tell when I've caught up. There's a, a pretty easy way to figure it out. A lot of items over there that they're gonna just claim. I think I need to just go for this. Go for this and hope it's the one. next closest item, is it worth me just resetting at this point? This seems really bad. I'm so far from anything. I did get a pearl, and pearls are pretty dang valuable. I'm very happy about that pearl. Thank you for the GL. We're kinda sorta on the home stretch. <clears throat> uh, I got what felt lucky, but it might have been might have been kind of expected given how long this is. Um there is potentially some really cool tech. So there's a way to duplicate items pretty easily. Um, it takes a little time, but it's really easy to do. And when I first heard about that, I thought, like, well, I guess that's cool that you can, you know, get a bunch of valuable stuff, but, like, you can already get some valuable stuff? Should I have duped that curse gem, the thing that was worth, like, 6,000? Would it have been worth doing that until I got fully leveled? If I was having Winner delivering six of those per round, that's 30,000 per round? I should have done that. That's the fast strat. Anyway, I interrupted myself. You can duplicate items. One of the items in this game, uh, it's this neat book, it's called Folklore. The game doesn't make it worth very much because it only expects there to be one of them in play. And what it does is it makes it so that when you move, monsters can't spawn next to you. The only way monsters spawn is when a player moves and ends their turn, a monster might spawn next to them. And if you have this item in your inventory, that stops happening. 
And you can duplicate this item and give it to everybody. And so, when you're trying to make a bunch of money really fast, you can just stop combat from being part of the game. And you can see how long these fights are. This is what the game is normally like with all these fights going on. But with me right now, when, I, when I'm playing against uh, multiplayer opponents, there's just no fighting. Everything goes really fast. If it weren't for folklore, I suspect this would take me like an extra hour at least. I wish I had thought about duping that that cursed gem though. That would have given me so much money. <laughs> Did not occur to me at all until now. It would have taken a while. Not super long, but a little while to uh to fill people's inventories with that though. But then you only would have had to do a couple rounds. <sighs> next time. Next time. When I find a curse gem. Dupe the curse gem. That's the moral of this run. Oh my god. I keep almost hitting leg traps. That guy is probably going to get all three of those items before I can. Should I go for the other item that's kind of out of the way? Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I don't see myself catching up to him for either of those. If he gets it, it was just going to be bad luck regardless. <laughs> almost. Almost reached the item. I could potentially take him in a fight also. If he gets the item, it's worth trying. I might be able to land a good hit on him. I'm low on health, but if I start the fight, I could potentially do it. Yes! Okay, now I just need to get to the the exit. Every other leg trap to that point was foreshadowing. <laughs> that is so rude of the game. <sighs> However, it is also very funny. And that's okay. That makes it okay. I... no... I want these monsters to kill me. I... Uh, if that guy is running away from me, but I don't think he is, I think he's gonna turn right around and come back to me. Right? He's not. Even so, the other guy's coming after me, but if the monsters kill me, I can just go to the, the exit at full speed instead of broken leg speed. Yeah, fight me. Almost. You almost beat me. Oh, this is a good hit. It's a lot of damage on one of these. Uh, yeah. Attack it again. Sure. It's rare to kill those. I hope the other one can kill me, though. I mean, I do get extra money for winning fights against these. Uh-oh, wait a minute. No, this is really bad suddenly. I also didn't know that was a slime. I thought that was also a robot for some reason. Um, yeah, no, the plan might be backfiring a little bit. This is suddenly kind of bad. Um, what do I do? I could probably run away from that guy. I could give up the pearl I have, but... 
But that's money. I like money. One. Gross. Why are you fighting the mob and not coming after me? I, I guess I'm just hoping I get the exit card at this point. That's, that's what I'm banking on. Oh, he's running. Okay. Ooh! The thing I tried. Perfect. Now the mob attacks me. No. Now this mob attacks me. No. God damn it. <sighs> if I walk up and attack this mob, it would probably kill me. But I need to roll well enough to go up to it. Thank God. Okay. And don't use anything, just be murdered. That's all I want. That looks good. Yes! Okay, where do I respawn? That's good enough. I can, I can work with that. You may be asking, if you haven't been watching this for seven and a half hours, why did you want that to happen? And yeah, you'll notice, suddenly my leg isn't broken anymore, and I can actually move again. And it's not just that I can move faster to try to approach the exit, it's also that when people attack me, my best option is usually to run away from them. And with my broken leg, I wasn't getting any move bonus for that. So now it's more likely that I can run from people. run to... suppose here would be my best option. Yes, everybody heal. Yes, run away like a fool. level 12-ish? Not a chance, guy. Jacobson, I think, is his name? Yeah, thanks, Vakif. Uh, I have a thing to sell. I have a pearl to sell for, like, 2,000, I think? Pearls sell pretty well. 2600, very nice. Ooh. Nope, nothing else to sell. 28k, and it's like 30 something to level up, right? 40, okay. That's right, 40 and then something like 48. So it seems like it is absolutely worth getting all the way to level 14 um, before... Ooh, another roast beef mission. Uh, level 14 before going back to story missions. No, honestly, I think I'm better off... Um, low health at the moment. 
I, I don't think having less health is really hurting me right now. What is that? It was hard to see. It looked like I just picked up a big spider. <laughs> Got an elephant. Naturally. It did I get an elephant? I actually got an elephant. Uh one of the categories of things in this is antiques. So I'm gonna go ahead and guess that's like an elephant statue. I I didn't golf, but you were right. I'll I'll never doubt you again. Promise. of slime dropped a gun. <sighs> Good. Dodge to the trap. I assume thanks to the card I played and not my attempt at timing the input. Yeah, you are gonna attack me. I can run from you, and I think that's my best bet. Yep. To arsenic. Um, how much health do you have? Or what items do you have? Do you have anything good? Not really. You have that gun. I'm gonna just get her out of the way. So I think this is almost a guaranteed one shot. Yeah. And she was just gonna keep following me and attacking me every turn, so that seems better. target item is the one next to me. <laughs> is there... There's one other spot it could be. And I'm not terribly close to that. You can stand on items, right? Yes. Yes. <laughs> well done, Arsenic. You got the enemy right where you wanted it. On top of the item. I don't think enemies can stand on the exit, which I find interesting. I've never seen them move on top of it. Not to say it's definitely impossible, just I haven't seen it. Shoot. Um... Okay, this is gonna be a little tricky. We might be able to make it work. 
but it's gonna be a little tricky. Depends a little bit on what Arsenic does here. She's moving, which means the enemy's gonna follow her. That gives me an opening. I do have good move. I'm not that far away, but she is closer than me. If I'm lucky, she'll hit a trap? We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. My inventory is super full right now. Which is a little unfortunate. Yeah, you're also pretty close to that. That's exactly what I wanted. Thank you. You're running off to her. Yeah, I've got a chance of getting it. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Maybe I should attack her. I'll see I'll see what my movement roll is. I'll decide based on that. Ooh. If I moved here, it'd be a 50-50 chance that she could just move past me. If I move here and attack, it's the same 50-50 chance. But if I attack well, I couldn't attack that well, never mind. That's actually really risky for me to go there. I'll go here. I'll go here and hope for the best. I think she needs to roll a six, though, to get the item. You know, like that. Great. <sighs> we can try. Wanted to use my three. Not that it would have mattered, but I wanted to use that three. Yeah, that's her best option. Uh, just... Nah, nothing. God, she has so much in her inventory. I... I'm resetting. I, I'm not winning this. Her inventory is actually full right now, so... reset takes and also how long or how likely it is for you to just spawn next to the target item if you don't get it immediately is it worth just resetting instantly <laughs> rather than play out a whole whole match Ooh. 
Where do I go? Eh, next to something, at least. I guess that's the downside of having low health, is uh, damage traps can insta-kill you. I admit, I didn't think about that. I was so focused on how it's fairly inconsequential for battles, but uh, no, it really does matter for that. Cube! Nope. Um... I... Yeah, there's a game store or two that has been talked about. What do you want to know, Golf? Just like which one it is? Yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, given that we're getting there relatively late, like to the event, um... Um, I don't know that we're necessarily going to go with other people. Um, I think there's been discussion about when a gift exchange would actually happen. I want to say people were saying Saturday, but I'd need to check again. I, I think I'm going to be bringing, like, a, a backup game if I don't find something at a game store, though. There it goes. It took a while to load. But yeah, I think uh, I think if we do go, you and I would go on Friday. I will. If you remind me, I'll I'll check the uh, the Discord and see where people were talking about after this run. Yeah, that's fine. We can do it in the morning. down there. I kind of think I should just go to the exit. Go to the exit and then hope. Bats. <laughs> what the heck, man? I think I want to let bats kill me. Because I'm pretty sure he's just going to take the Game Boy I just picked up, so, like, might as well. more than enough. Yep, where do I go? 
That's not helping. I'm resetting again. I was also thinking I should probably set up a uh, Discord group chat for our hotel group. Just to have one place for you and me and Wolf and Crash to communicate. Is there something up top? There is something up there, but it's far enough out of the way. I'd rather get these while I'm here. You're probably about to backtrack to that. about to backtrack to me. That also works. Let's just run. Cool. <laughs> nope. Oh well. Helga's got two. I've got one further up that I can go after. I'm mad that you moved that way, actually. Bren, really hoping you would walk onto my damage trap. Do I want to walk onto my damage trap? Just respawn somewhere else? Everything is so far away. That seems like the fastest way to get anywhere. Yeah, I'll do it. Speedrun strats. Set a damage trap, walk right back onto it to teleport. Speed run! <laughs> Darn. It was worth a try. When I wake up, I'll just head up north and see if it's that item. That's the only one I really have a shot at getting right now. Unless I walk onto the exit and get teleported somewhere good, but... There's absolutely no guarantee of that. <clears throat> Ooh, or I could kill Bren. I probably couldn't kill Bren. That's a bad idea. I shouldn't try that. Also, Bren's about to heal. Folklore. Just go around, I guess. Hope there aren't any extra traps. And go around. I'm mostly covering where I just walked, so I'm hopefully good? It's just a question of if Helga gets the item instead. Also, what Bren does, is she gonna attack me again? Really? Why? What are you doing? Stop it! 
Come on, dude. Fine, take my item. I don't care. You're right. Bren is the karma of this game catching up to me. Hugo, please get your item. Thank you. Okay, now I know that that is the item. Come on, one shotter. Nope, that's not gonna do it. It's gonna be a good amount of damage, but not quite enough. And unfortunately, she's probably going to kill it here, and she has a plus 9 defense, so I am going to need to run from her to be able to uh, to get to the end. I'm not going to be able to, to punch her out. Hopefully she'll heal again here. Good. It'd help a lot more if I'd stop rolling ones. Oh, there's another item! I didn't notice. I didn't realize there was another one up there. Oops. Uh-oh. Is she gonna dodge the trap? No, good. <laughs> and then this enemy's gonna kill her. Maybe. We'll see. Move! Oh, that's why I was hitting the wrong button. That's not the item. Um... I'm resetting. I, I can't take out one of those characters. Okay, this is the one. I believe it. Fully, with my entire sense of being, this is the one I'm gonna win. Where does it send me? No. <laughs> I tried. I tried really hard. You saw how much I tried. This is the... where is anything? Am I close to anything? No! I'm the furthest from anything! What the hell? <laughs> we'll get it one of these times. Any time... it looks horrible. But any time now, you're gonna see, I'm gonna start a mission, 
and I'm gonna move and it'll just be the item right there. That's how this works. That's how this has always worked. Eventually, it just happens. It's not worth wasting my time on Renault. With that high speed, they're just gonna surrender and give up items and keep running away. Dude, come on. Okay. Next time I reset, I'll spend the money to heal. I I can't keep dealing with that. I am still going. This has taken a little longer than I thought. Just just a little bit longer than I thought. Just one one bit longer than I thought. Only one. Only one bit. <clears throat> He'll bite. It will. Oh, I said I was gonna heal. Yeah, I do need to do that. This has actually become a problem. Uh, sure. I think that should be enough that uh, the damage traps won't kill me, and that's the important thing. still make food after this. 
It's not gonna be chicken parm. That is way too much work at this point. But I do have some tortillas, and I do have chicken. And I could make like a burrito. Nice, simple chicken burrito. We have some, uh, some yellow onions in the fridge. Dice that up, throw that in. Got some cheddar cheese, sour cream, hot sauce. I think we have avocado too, but I don't know how old that avocado is. Gotta also go get a Grunt Rep Supreme. Yo! <laughs> it's, uh, it's going, it's going. This is a much longer run than I hoped it would be. I've had some bad luck, but this run is all about luck, and I knew that when I was getting into it. If I didn't lose an hour and a half by mission six, I would be feeling so good right now. That's where I'd be. How are you doing, man? Hope you are well. Another one! Why? I also don't recognize this dungeon layout. This is... such a weird corridor-y one. I was thinking about it, did I do any long runs in 2023? I don't think I even did a Spresh- I mean, I didn't do the Winter Spresh Vecta, I don't think I did a Summer one. I don't think I did any long runs this last year. So it's- it's good for me that I did this. <laughs> That's- I'm just- I'm trying to justify it. This is a good thing that I'm doing. Doing nine, ten hour long speed runs, these, you know, it's good for the the blood. Should probably get this one first. That other guy's gonna get it. Or hat lore is just gonna heal again, that works. <laughs> he is a little bit, yeah. I love the names in this. Oe. This was- oh, I got the elephant again! This was a Japanese game originally, so I imagine it's just some weird translation choices. They're going for that. I should probably go north for the box up there. Because there's no way I can get to that this turn. <laughs> Okay, is that the item? You're not even getting it! Why? <laughs> you dumb computers! God, I hate you! <laughs> This is one of the AI types where instead of going for items, uh, you prioritize trying to kill people 
and just taking whatever they have. And it's so frustrating because I need to know what's in these boxes and they're not getting them! Oh wait, please go get that box. You have reasonable AI. I know you're going for it. Okay, good. Good. Yes! And the exit's right there. Okay, we have a chance. We have a chance on this one. Oof. It's about time. How long have we been on mission 13? I think it's been like 40 minutes. Maybe not that long. I might be identify er, identifying. I'm mixing up words. Exaggerating. That's the word I want. I shouldn't have used that. <sighs> okay. Okay. Next turn, I gotta use my plus three evasion. I don't need to move extra. <laughs> the important thing is I avoid any traps. And we do get to identify the elephant, yes. Move. Extra evasion. Don't hit any traps. Thank god. Oh my goodness. Oh. Okay. If I'm right, it's two more missions. We're so close. Okay. First of all, sell this gun. Sell this floppy disk. I want to identify the elephant. It's slow, it's losing time, but I really want to identify the elephant. It's a figurine! Golf, it's a figurine! <laughs> 200! It's worthless! Fantastic. It does nothing. It sits on a shelf and makes you sad that it does nothing. Okay, I'm gonna save. I'm pretty sure I'm caught up on story missions, but I want to make sure first. So real quick, if I say, give me a mission, yes, I am caught up on story missions. Okay. So we will load the other characters back in, do a little bit more of that. Level up, get most of the way to another level up, and then finish the game. We're almost there. Genuinely almost there. It tells you what it tells you what uh, the relic level is when you start these missions. I didn't realize that. My hair is tangled in a very painful way, I just noticed. Oh my god. Stop it. Stop it, hair. Uh, where's items? I want you to go... S just go get that one. Just go get that one that's right there. I will tell it. Stop it. What are you doing? Why... Why does long hair have to be like this? I make all this effort to grow it out, and then it just hurts me. <laughs> okay, and then you will get the ones that are all up here. The one that is all up here. Silver, that's good, that's worth a lot. Oh, there's a bunch down there, I didn't realize. Crutch, that's not worth that much. That's worth less, <laughs> it's worth less. Uh, I guess you start heading south, that's the plan. Because there are a bunch of items down here that you should start getting. You should actually get that flag. I'd like to let Winner get control of all the items over here. Uh, you can still go get that other item, though. You can go pick up the blue flag that just moved. 
There's nothing up here, right? Yes, okay. Good, that's also valuable. Um, I guess wander around. That's, that's the play for you. It's also not worth very much. There's the yellow flag, and the red flag. That's unfortunate. Um, those are in horrible places, and pretty much only winner is going to get them, so... You go get the green flag. There's nothing down here, right? Yeah, okay. Yeah, you go get the green flag. You do nothing. You return to your... Yes, you go get the blue flag. very bossy. It's true. You know me. Zandot, the boss, Bruce Springsteen, toaster. There's the item. Is your inventory full? It is. You have that book, though, and that's not worth very much, so do get that other item still. I... whatever, it doesn't matter. God, these move so fast when you don't have to do any battles. I'm so happy I thought to do Folklore. Thank goodness. That's worth more than a book. A damage trap! That's worth more than a book! I just don't do anything. <clears throat> I'm just gonna let Winter walk back home now. Uh, get this flag, actually. Cool. Good call. green flag do? If you're low on cards, it refills your cards. I don't remember the exact numbers on it. I think, like, if you're out of cards, rolling a six fills your hand completely, and numbers less than that just give you fewer cards, maybe? I, I don't remember. I so rarely don't have cards when I hit that flag. I, I don't know. Flags are not worth 250 points. <laughs> there is no way I only got two flags as winner there. Um, yeah, that's fine. I don't think anybody else can level. Yeah, no. That is fine, though. Let's sell a bunch of stuff. There we go. 
Okay. Let's go ahead and save winner again. And then do another one. And it costs like 48.5 to level again. So I guess if I get up to like 48k, or 48, like 40k, I'll uh... I'll go back to story mode, do the last missions. need to be moving most of these guys around anymore. I think I basically just want them to pick up flags in case the flags end up near them. But like, it's not like I'm gonna be leveling them much anymore. We only have a few missions left. I think it's probably better for me to just start letting them mostly rest. I'll get items that are super far out of the way, but other than that, Winner should mostly be in control here. Um, I do kind of want to get this one box. That's a good item. I should get that. So good item, I'm glad I got that. That's not a good item, that's not worth getting. That's also a good item. Okay. So B has a couple of things to pass off to Winner. There's a trap. Okay. <clears throat> um... Yeah. Okay, good. Um, he's... Their winner's inventory is actually already pretty full... ...of mostly good things. Those gems are worth any more than the anything else in my inventory is. I think that band is worth less than uh, than one of the gems. That's about it. Could also, yeah, Toby is right outside. He make a noise. I, I don't need to do anything else with these characters. Any effort to level them up is uh, just kind of wasted. Oh my God, my bed is closed off. He cannot get to my bed.
buddy. Oh my god. Okay. I'll let him in. He has decided this is the room he wants to be in. Come on. Yeah, come here. Come here. There you go. You're fine. You're fine. See, you're okay. God. <laughs> okay. You're a good kitty. You are. buddy. Good buddy. Yeah. Cobain, stop eating my pants, please. sees the strings coming off of the, the sweatpants and thinks that they are mice tails. Winner hits so many stun traps this round. <laughs> Kitty. What are you doing? Yeah, just lay down. You're fine. See, you're fine. That's a good kitty. He really is a stunning dungeon. Good one, Gold. Very good one. There you go, everybody. Yeah, uh, what a flop. What a flop of a level. need to do another mission. Yeah, the items were worth a decent amount. to immediately happen. Cool. I am... Um, kinda tempted to... try to just finish this one immediately. Um, I was able to walk to a blue flag on my first turn, and I rolled a one and it gave me a leg trap. So, winner's leg is broken right now. That's what. <clears throat> into that.
This is a long one. It really, really is. I'm sure smarter people could make it shorter, but, uh, but it's a long one for me. Midnight waffles sound pretty good right now. <laughs> That's worth a lot. Also worth a lot. Okay. Winner should be able to fill their pockets this time pretty well. <clears throat> we will see what is, uh, what's also in those boxes. surprised I did I mean how long was the casual playthrough I did on stream and I don't think anybody said they knew this game and that maybe it's just because I've been streaming so long today but during this one eight and a half hour speed run three people have come in today and said they knew this game ah oh, folklore I don't need more folklore I don't need a damage trap either no just walk up to him. <clears throat> yeah, the casual run is definitely, like, at least twice as long as this. Give up this, replace the red Game Boy, I guess? Oh, the coin is worth way less, actually. <laughs> I didn't realize there was another trap up there. Uh, I want you to walk up and hit him and fix his leg. Like magic, winner's leg is fixed. Nope, not you. Uh, I do want winner to go get that other item, though. And yeah, this is pretty long. A lot of this, though, has been that I got pretty dang bad luck in some of the story missions. Like, the, the grinding to level up, that takes a while, for sure. But I suspect with just the same strategy and better luck, this could be like a 5-hour run instead of a 9 or 10-hour run. With much better luck, I'm sure it could go down to like four hours, but that would be... That would be stretching it. There we go. Okay, winner. Go to the end now. Go win. Nope. Not you. Are we a hero yet? We have a cat sitting on us, so maybe. I don't 
exactly know the definition, but maybe. It's it's possible. <laughs> the traps just never let up. There we go. Good kitty. It's likely. Okay, sell these items. 3200. This is the Game Boy that gives you a 25% resistance to traps. Which is still not enough. those stack? No. Not to my knowledge. I think it's just one at a time. Um, B can definitely level up. Can A? No. close to anything. You're close to a green flag. You can go get that green flag. You also have five movement, which is nice. There's a decent chance you're... Oh no, you only have four. You, the one, has five. Okay, never mind. I, I got the characters mixed up. That's easy to do when they all look the same and have similar names, and <laughs> you're not looking at them. God damn it, again? You know what, that's fine. That's fine. I can just give up that bottle I just picked up, which I assume isn't worth very much. I could be wrong. That's worth a lot. Yeah, how about you walk over to A and just get attacked? That's a black bottle, though. That might be worth more. I, I don't think I've seen a black bottle before. So many leg traps. Now you're not near anything. <laughs> There's the target item. silver. I will take that gladly. Ugh, sorry, Toby. Poor kitty. Takes up so much space on my lap. He can't help it. He can't help being a big old kitty. Oh, 
cool. You can chill there, I guess. Uh, no, actually, I want you to pick up this item. And then you two can walk back together. In case it's also good. give the, the black bottle back and see if that's worth anything. there's an item near the exit. Nah, it's not much. too far. Didn't want to stand there. Sorry, Eliza. I'm sorry. You got me. Seven fifty. I thought that was something else. That's not worth very much at all. Twenty five. That's also not worth much. Now I know. Now I know. <laughs> I know you do, Eliza. Um, I want to go back to story mode. I'd need a really good story mission to get enough to level up, I think. So I will do one more. One more of these, and then I will have the two story missions to go. Thank you, Omni, for the sheep. Much appreciated.
Uh, and this time, I'm just gonna have Winter wander around. Nobody else needs to do anything. You're kidding. Every round. Okay, other people need to do things because Winter can't win on his own. Winter needs a lot of help to win. of good, that's right. You're not close to, like, anything, are you? Or which one is that? Is that B? They did already pick up an item. Okay. Here's what I'm thinking. You're gonna go there. Uh, you're gonna walk up. And attack him. You're gonna give up that book. And then you're going to attack Winner in a second. Uh, let Winner get that item first. <clears throat> Where is the other item? Oh, there's more over there. Okay. Even better. Can't- I love it. Great. You're gonna stand there and attack Winner. Winner, you're gonna give up that book you got. Or that bottle. We're- That's the target item! Oh, I'm stupid. I didn't want to give that up. I was thinking entirely in, like, currency value. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever, man. It's the last mission, it doesn't matter. Okay, you're gonna walk right back over to Winter and give that bottle back. That's the new plan. was never the fastest way to get to that item. Okay. Give it back. Thank you. Now you never have to do anything again. Uh, you, I'd kind of like to give those claws over. Winner's walking over this way anyway. You don't need to do anything either. Go to the exit.
That should be enough now. That should be plenty of money. Yes, absolutely. Especially after selling this. I'm level 15 now. No, don't try another mission. Uh, actually, no, I'm gonna hold on to that. I'm pretty sure I can get to level 15, and that item does actually do something. Which means I should identify it real quick. No, I can't both identify and level up, can I? Wait, wait. How much does leveling up cost? No, I'm good. I'm good. Never mind. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. That item prevents panic? Does it prevent panic entirely? It j I think it just prevents panic entirely. Which doesn't come up all the time, but it does come up. So I might as well... Might as well have it. I don't think there's a correlation between box and item. Not to my knowledge. Oh, Tobin, you're so heavy on my legs. They're kind of, they're kind of sore holding you up. Nope, oh, one more, one more save. Okay, we have two missions left. Two missions and that's the end of the game. <laughs> it is a good kitty, it's true, it's true. Good buddy. Okay. Where are we going? Yeah, we can go that way. trying to stay comfy on the lap. A 20 damage damage trap. That is painful. Are there any items near me or should I reset? Yeah, there's a couple over here. I should go for them.
If it's neither of these, though, I'm gonna reset. Oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> I was falling asleep, that completely woke me up. I was so prepared to reset. <laughs> Sorry, kitty. I don't want to let these enemies kill me. I'm pretty far from the exit. Um... Oh wait. No, I'm not. Never mind. I didn't realize there was a path through here. Did I upset the kitty? Well, I moved my legs, and naturally that upset the kitty. Um, it's just a, a fact about cats that they get upset when you remind them that you don't exist solely for their comfort. I really hope these enemies have low movement rolls. This might be bad. I might get completely blocked here. I probably shouldn't have moved where I did, actually. That might have been a mistake. not a low roll. That's the opposite of a low roll. That's actually quite a high roll you just made. A high roller you could call that cat. Cool. Where do I respawn? <laughs> Great. In the middle of everybody. That's exactly what I wanted. <laughs> maybe you're right on me. Maybe. Maybe. fight me? Not. None of you are. <sighs> that guy's probably gonna come block my way, though. Or you are. Or all of you are. <laughs> Just get out of my way, guys. Just let me go win. Let me win the speed run. That's all I'm asking. <sighs> no, don't attack me again, please. How am I losing the movement roll? I have plus six movement. How am I losing this?
<laughs> I mean, it's not so much about owning the cat, I think, as it is if you are in the proximity of any cat, that is the cat that you should be helping. so excited for it. You're totally right. <laughs> nope, wrong E. And I am in range of, uh, of dying to a damage trap again, so I, uh... I will go ahead and heal. <laughs> I forgot about that line where the mission broker says, Hey, player, what do you think? Next sentence. I know you don't care either. God, this game is so good. Oh yeah, I have stuff to sell. Just to, for the sake of clearing my inventory, get it out of here. Does it matter if this is in my inventory? I don't think so. I don't know. I didn't mean to do that. Let's just save again. Save without it there, because we're probably going to need to reset a bunch. Last mission. We are on the last mission of the game. Nine hours in. I'm like 80% sure this is the last mission. Yes. No, this is it. This is the last one. Yes. Thank God. Okay. Guys, when should time be? You need to help me figure this out. Is time when I hit the exit? Is time when the screen fades to black? Is time when the credits starts? When is time? I never decided. If it's before the credits starts, then we get to just like watch the, or read through the ending scene at our own pace. Time is when we return to that sheep wallpaper. I see. It's last input for Tass, but like, last input before what? Before credits? Before winning? Before the last cutscene? I can't win against any of these agents, I need to reset. <laughs> I'm gonna say... When screen fades to black after hitting the exit. That's that's what I'm going with. So I can still read the, the dialogue after if I want. Be leisurely about that. All good, golf. I can do that. Good kitty. Ooh, I'm actually, ah, I'm actually starting next to a couple of items. Let's see if it's one of these. And 
the monster spawned. Poor guy. No. <laughs> I mean, I want to reset again and re-roll it, but I should at least wait until I know that somebody else, uh... Somebody else gets the item. Because for all I know, all these computers are too stupid to get it. When was the last time I said poor beefs and meant it? It's, yeah. That's definitely not something I say very often. Um... I guess I'll go up? I guess I'll go up. Oh, strange, we're all starting close to each other. <clears throat> Is it possible to have negative defense? No. I don't think anything can do that. minimum normally, and I don't think there's anything that lowers your defense. Yeah, another stunned monster spawn. <laughs> Oop, no. That's what I wanted. Low roll, low roll. That's not a low roll! Okay, well... I do have four more speed than that guy, so I should be able to catch up at least. Okay, which way am I going? Bottom? Bottom. Oh, sure, he can run away from you. <laughs> Another sp stunned monster spawn. <laughs> Amazing. So soft. Look at this foot. Look at these little foot beans. So good. 
Good buddy. Darn. What is that? That's a new item. That's a very new item to me. It looked like a- yeah, an angel wing. but I don't think I'll be able to. Unfortunately, the only Beefs agent that is close is also the one that isn't panicked. If I get a good movement roll, I might be able to take that item from him and then run backwards to the one I'm standing next to. Next turn. Yeah, try to snipe it. If I get the movement roll. And, you know, there's not, like, a trap in the way, which is also always possible. Six. Oh, so close. Is it this? It was this anyway. Okay. Throw out the Game Boy. We don't need the Game Boy. We absolutely need the wing. I'm very curious about the wing. Oh, I'm coming up on time. I gotta get my foot ready on the pedal. It's been so long since I've split. Nice six hour final split. <laughs> so close to finishing in one turn. One more turn. One more round. One tile short yet again. <sighs> Luckily, I can't run into a trap this time. I actually am guaranteed to win at this point. Nothing can stop me. Literally nothing can stop me. I am unstoppable. One. Hoo! Hooey! Why? Why again? I love that line. I love that line, first of all, Dolph. I'm glad you're here for it, because I love the writing in this game. Why? And why again? We, the selected, should never lose against you. I won't accept it. Give me the disc! So be it. Kill him and get the disc for the selected and our new world! Huh? What is this? My troops, they are losing! It's... it's, a uh, Valkyf. Great, now we have finally defeated them. What a battle that was. And Shuichi, too! I was able to complete my job, also. I found their facility and used the Hav Cannon to destroy it. Mr. Sakimaru's staff will now clean up and capture any Beef's members let. I didn't notice that typo before. That said let, not left. Thank you for your cooperation. We could not have done it without you, winner. You have saved millions of people from death. I need to ask you for one more thing. This matter is very confidential. Please do not tell anyone about Beef's and what happened. I'm not sure how society would react to this if they found out. I don't want to disclose information about the mutants. It may cause serious discrimination issues. Sadly, there are still others like Beefs. 
the end. We did it. We won. <laughs> Oh, what was the other one? Oh, a tense error. Yeah, there were a lot of tense errors in this game. My prize is dinner, I think. I'm gonna make a chicken burrito. Luckily, I have a three-day weekend. And then I work one day, and then I have a seven-day weekend. <laughs> uh, but first I want to identify that angel wing and see what's up with that. Right after these credits. Oh, chicken and dumplings, oh my god. I'm so hungry. <laughs> I... I ate at like 2.30, but I had a big lunch. It, it was more food than I should have eaten. Although in retrospect, it was a good amount of food considering I did this. Thank you, Eliza. And golf for the GGs. And this is the background we get for winning. Look at how cluttered it is. Isn't it amazing? You heal while moving! Oh my god! I did see that in the item list. That is an extremely good one. How much is it worth? 8,000! Oh my god! Neat. Okay. I'd like to do a New Game Plus category for this sometime. Where, um... Where you can just bring in pre-existing characters. So before I do that, I'm gonna get a character with a bunch of duped angel wings and just sell so many of them. No, it is 1.25 a.m. for me. I don't know where you're getting that it's daylight. <laughs> it, uh, hold on. Let me move the camera a little bit. That's, that's my window. It's very much nighttime. Oh, you know what? The window behind me. That's not an outside window, that's an inside window. That window connects to the rest of the apartment. <laughs> it's a... Killing Pepsi called it uh, a sitcom window, because you can open it up and then look down into the main room. <laughs> yeah, I'm West Coast US. Amazing song, love it. Uh, I'm also gonna sell this jam. 3,000, wait, what is this? Aquamarine, okay, yeah, I'll take 3,000 for it, sure. Thanks. did it. We actually did it. I wasn't sure I would, but we did it. Ugh. Let's see who's on to raid. Maybe Fady might be live? Fady's often live around this time. No. Yes, Fady is live. Neil live, TK. I'll raid Fady. Thank you everybody for sticking through this. This was extremely long. Uh, have have a good night, all. <laughs>